swearing. Okay. Got I mean, you can. Swear, We're the the stream is marked as for for a uh, mature audience. Yeah. Oh, okay. So then so. we've been noticing there's been a severe lack of us talking about taxes and mortgages. And I refuse to do a tax stream. Other other uh, adult subject matter. You keep saying that, but what if they gamified it? Oh yeah, I forgot to mention my roommate almost burned our house to house last night. Nice. Damn, dude. Yeah, and they have like houses are on fire. I'm very yeah, familiar with. They that. have like scented candles, and I woke up at two a.m. with like a beeping. One of the candles on fire. Rookie mistake. It was great. Never, yeah, you're yeah. Toaster to did mine. In. Ne never light the candles on fire. Candles are for looking at and picking up in the grocery in the in the, the store and going, huh, neat, and putting them back on the shelf. Yeah. I heard candles are for licking. Uh, <laughs> no. Wouldn't recommend that either. I agree. I like going to Michael's in the candle section and just going through and just going like, hmm, this this smells like what it's labeled as. What, what do you mean, fine? Can I ask why? That definitely reads as Heim. Hi. Heim. I don't even know if that would be right. Should have looked it up. I think there might not have an E. Let's see if we can. Yeah, yeah that's not. Uh, I'm pretty sure that's not how you spell. Let's see. Heinz. Heineken. H -E -I -N -E -N. Oh, yeah. oh yeah, there it is. Yeah. yeah. There you go. Anyway, who's recapping? Not me, because I got Heineken's right. Okay. I'll, I'll recap. <laughs> I'm kidding, I do have recap notes. Actually, I have two I pages of notes. You did get Heineken's wrong, because you didn't capitalize the proper noun, and uh, Heineken's would with be... An with an apostrophe. Yeah. Sure. I'm so confused. I feel like the rest of the party in on stream could be a bit louder, at least match your your volume, Izzy. Oh, sure, I can do it. you're louder than the rest. I can still hear the other people, but you're definitely louder. Uh, okay. I can turn- I can adjust Hopefully a little bit. Will blow everyone's eardrums out. Cack, cack, cough, Would you cack, like cough. me to speak like this? Is that better? Oh. If you start doing yeah. that, Max, I'm going to crank the gain up all the way on my mic. How's- how's that cubed? <laughs> uh... Does it sound terrible? No, People are right. talking. It's just, we're, it, we're just fucking with audio settings, so if we're fucking with like audio stuff, yeah, that should be good. Really gonna crank cool, cool. Yeah, true. No, yeah, no, please, please, no. My ears. Just so you guys know, my gain slider is at five out if, of a hundred. If if you fuck, if you do that, I will just mute Discord, hey, I just, and then all suffer. We'll suffer, but stream. I, I just <laughs> said if other people kept doing it, I would do it. I, never said I, was I don't know how to mess with my audio settings, so there. My microphone just has a gain, like, dial. Yeah, because you got a fancier one. I think mine does yeah, too, which is funny. That, which, I don't know if I ever mentioned it to anyone, but it is on a boom now. Oh, like, hell yeah. it's over my computer. It's been like this for ages. I just never mentioned it. That explains why it. your sound is more consistent. <laughs> that makes sense. <laughs> Yeah, it was is a, is a nice boom. It, it's I can't believe how well it stuck to my desk when I could only get like three quarters of the clamp onto it. Anyway, uh, recap. Uh, spiders out in the world. Um. <laughs> uh, we went back to so at the beginning of the last session we went back to Sky's domain. Um. Soul. We found out that Sol did a surprise drop-in because he could just apparently hear his name anywhere, uh, and he devil devil fied the boat. <laughs> he changed the rocket into a ship. Yes, um, it's a space ship. Space boat. Yeah. Um. Uh, we gave the sword back to Nit. Uh, we went back to Moros's domain in the ship. Doug did some. Uh, last minute goodbyes, and he has a date for when he gets back. You may even sound like I'm gonna die and not come back. You, you are. I Wait a no, no. I ended that with you have a date when you get back. Doesn't that heavily imply you're coming yeah. back? True. Uh, you got a cool new pike. 
um, we chatted with Soul when you went to do something. Phone call? I don't remember. Um, uh, then we went back to Skies to look for the cat. Uh, we found the shrimp, and it's on a different planet. You don't know that. We do know it's that. somewhere. Didn't he tell us? You oh, saw a video of it in a building. That is in a place with lots of... You know of what? Fair enough. I guess it could be on this planet. Um, the aliens have told us, like, you, a... You keep, you keep assuming planet. Because you said planet. And, and it, I, I think the aliens said it was, like, a satellite or something. Planet. A single time. We couldn't see... We couldn't see outside. This yeah, yeah. No, no. I'm saying, like... Indoors. No, I'm saying, uh... The shrimp could still be on the home planet where we started, but it could also be a different planet. We don't know. Um, uh, Val wrote some paper sendings, and then we yeeted into space. Um, within the first hour, we picked up some Scrain refugees <laughs> and learned about the Scrain. And Doug hates them. And Doug ha he just doesn't like aliens. Doug well, is, is, is literally job. xenophobic. It's crazy. No. Doug does not like other people picking him up and moving him around if it's not you, you know what that's for Stephanie. <laughs> it's... It, just so it's, it just so happens that we're uh, aliens. Feels some sort of way about it. Yeah. What's the yeah. map called by the way? It's again? not consensual. Uh Is that the words you're looking for? Not consensual. Yeah, I guess I guess it's not consensual is the, the word. Um, and then we got a list of all of the, the things, the people in the deck of many people at last, because I we finally sat down and looked through it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I, Bothered. I, I think I'm I'm in there at least once. Yep. Yes, you are. In fact, you're not even missing. Yep. Anyways. It would be really awkward if I showed up for session but my character was miss was missing. The main like, reason No, no, no. Uh so the cards the that hug, have hug, people hug. missing on them, gun? Mm. Are alive, and you're in it. Even so though you're, if you're in the card, you're that dead. Means you're then dead. Who was phone? Uh. Okay. Um. The main reason Val's never looked through this before was because Val, uh, because Mark said that if I had to, if I wanted to look through it, I'd have to draw cards. Yeah. No. I I, I rolled that decision back. Yeah. That was a long time ago. Yeah, but yeah. otherwise I would have looked through it a long time ago. <laughs> Obviously. And I would have had to have it done a long time ago. Oh, I wow. see. So, so that's why. <laughs> I understand. Mutually assured procrastination? I guess. To be perfectly honest with you. Nice. One of them still isn't done. Ah, so if we randomed into it. Well, here's the thing. If you random into a card and the person's not there, it doesn't Dial work. tone. Do you want to finally try it uh, out? No. So if you draw a card whose uh, person is missing, it doesn't do anything. So I, I don't have to put anything there. You know what? Fair enough. Oh, I guess another interesting thing is because the spiders died, this deck is so much more useful now. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you can always go kill some people if you want some cooler effects, too. It's like true. If the general's still alive, you could go kill him. Could, well, I and mean, we could also just use alive. him alive. What about the one with multiple people? Does it work or not work if they're the not lovers? both there? Yeah, yeah, like the lovers. It will work. You just get half? Nope. Oh, it just works? It just yep. works. Damn, uh. I wanted his teeth to kill Mars. Ah, Bethesda logic. <laughs> it just works, it I see. It just works. Until it doesn't. Okay, yeah, anyway, that's, that's the recap. That's basically it. We didn't Excellent. do too, too much. We just made it to space. In Mid fact, space, uh, dicked around on their derelict ship for like five minutes. Yes, Val and Doug both went to look at their ship. Oh yeah, we did. Nothing makes any sense. We just got some info. They're allergic the, the, to magic. The, the, the Prindle's not even the right letters. It's like <laughs> they're allergic to magic and they eat intellect. Oh yeah, and that yeah. means in danger. Right? But they aren't psychic. Yeah. So they can't eat each other. <laughs> well, they they could. Uh, they can sort of, but the problem is, uh, they won't gain a lot of nutrition from it because they are all fucked. Em 
It's are they're all empty calories. No, but I thought it's not I even thought... empty calories. It's that their body is so ravaged with diseases and malfunctions that they don't get the nutrition they need out of it. So they get that's out of weird. Because considering that, like, it's just how intelligent they are, right? To a degree, but I mean, if you eat a rotten steak, it's still a rotten steak. Yeah, just just because it's a an A5 Wagyu doesn't mean it wasn't dragged through, dragged across the street. Would it also be affected if they have like a mental disability? Yes. I so guess. if I just if I if we if we put like a bunch of diseases on Nami, would she be less tasty? <laughs> it's not that she would be less tasty. It'd be she'd be less healthy for them to eat because it's disease. Weird. How is that eat weird? Do, do you know how the mad cow disease transmits, Isabel? Do you understand how diseases in meat transmit? Yeah, I mean that's that's just how diseases transmit. But like, I, mean, right. I don't think I would ever eat a dead body. So I don't a diseased dead body. So yeah. Anywho, you've never eaten um, a dead body. I assume Have you two come back from the strain yeah, vehicle I'm touching... at some point. Yeah, I mean, turn yeah. to your ship. <laughs> Um, I think that the one, the leader, the uh, dozer, that Doug really doesn't like, would probably come back down onto the ship's deck too. Well, I guess we'll continue off to where we need to go. Yep, yep. just going. going We're here for a couple of days. Um... I love the the riveted plates on the deck of this. Very well put together. I love the giant flaming skulls to indicate it's on. Look at the plates. Like, yeah, it's fine. Why are there overlapping <laughs> for the anyway? Aesthetics. I don't know, I... <laughs> yeah, very well built. I don't know. I asked Soul. It's just, it's just the. No, 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 no. Soul gave it the magic. Uh, I uh, built it. <laughs> <laughs> Which is kind of weird, considering that he himself is very sleek and crow. <laughs> that is true. Hey, if it works. <laughs> Whatever works. <coughs> Throwing dynamite isn't a martial art. Um, yeah, so uh, the rest of the trip is uh, pretty quiet. I'll get a check from whoever is driving. So I'm survival currently check. Uh-huh. Ken. Do you want to you see in the future? <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, you can't do that again. Oh. Yeah. Doug's see into the future is once for long rest. Uh, want to take a long I've, rest? I've seen the future. I've seen what we've seen. And it has All right, been. I guess I'll roll survival because I'm in the chair and you're out there and I'm in here. And yeah. where's the caveman? We, 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 can we, can I give you advantage because we can both use the chair? Sure. Oh boy. Okay. What, what's your wisdom? Uh, plus three. You do F zero. <laughs> Uh, you don't have the advantage. You both sit together. It's pretty good. Be okay. Pretty good. Uh, you guys make it to the planet that Charade is on. No problem. Yeah, we did it. Oh, I should have gotten the gun that always. Fire. No, no, that always the fires. Bullet. Like it always fires, oh, and then the, the bullet that always fires, and the bullet that never fires. And like fire. a Trinity from the Matrix, and like dodge this, and then make everyone. I'm guessing with the context yeah, we have now, I, I think the reason why it would just destroy the world because it would be like an overflow or something. Well, I just make a little black hole, right? So it's... Do you think the simulation is strong enough to support a black hole? I feel like if you delete a bunch of things, it'll make it easier. <laughs> But that's not what a black hole does. I know. It's all still there. Just it's it's like the, the pentabyte bomb. It's the pentabyte bomb. A zip bomb. Yeah. Anyway, um, yeah, you guys have arrived. There's no port on this planet. It is, as far as you can see from orbit, like desolate. Uh, all right. Sure didn't choose the best place to live, did he? No, well, it's straight. I don't well, expect I much from him. 
Just to make I... things clear, are we there to kill him? Yes. Probably. Okay. Oh, Sounds like, good. I would have immediately, as soon as you were like, as soon as Doug was like, just to be clear, are we there to kill? And I would, Har would just go like, yes. <laughs> yeah. Totally interrupt him. We could have gotten rid of him like months ago. <laughs> but you had to side him in, with him in chess. I mean, I'm not entirely convinced the game master would have been much better, but. Yeah, but at least we would have. We have the chance to finish it now. Yeah, anyways, we should probably land. Yeah. Who's landing the ship? Crash. Falcon landed the ship. Sorry, Make was it Doug and Val that chose? Space vehicle skill check. Are you proficient in it? Uh, I'm not an artificer. Um. <laughs> oh. Make Damn, an untrained dexterity up. check. Oh, fuck, it's dexterity. Uh. Oh, oh, that's there's pretty good. No oh my god. god. <laughs> you land the ship. <laughs> Hell yeah. Nice. That's crazy. The, huh? the dozer like looks and goes, Can you fly ships often? No, this that's one just impressive. is. This one's just flown with the mind. Oh. That sounds wholly dangerous. They're just that good. If it's flown with the mind, what happens if there's a short circuit? We fixed it. I have to uh, assume. We all die. Does, does your mind explode? I have to assume bad things. I don't want to know. Okay. Like, I don't want to find out. I do, but I don't want to... <laughs> you don't want to be in the chat. That's a hypothesis. I mean, Val's the healer between the two of us. <laughs> Can she heal somebody going brain dead? Yes. Yeah, is the brain something you can regenerate? What's the inverse of feeble mind? <laughs> um, Mega Dozer kind of looks at all of you guys. Mega mind. So, what are you doing on this planet again? Looking for right. a clown. We're off to see the I'm wonderful, the wonderful wizard of Oz. Well, he's more of a jester. That's about correct. Oh, that's funny. Um, right, and so. You park near where he is? No idea. No word. That's why we're looking for him. Do you not have... You can just look through the whole planet. Yeah. <laughs> what? He'll I show mean, up. Yeah, I don't doubt that he'd find us as soon as he knows we're here. No, I'm pretty sure he already knows we're here. Does the ship not have a scanning system? It does. Okay. <laughs> Doesn't it? It does. Yeah. You know that. Can we do that? I'd like to use it as well. Yeah, yeah, I'd like to do that. <laughs> Another uh, It is an Also, he definitely check. knows we're here. To activate the uh, topology scanner. Ah. Uh, Fifteen worse. is a DC. Congrats. Um, so you get a topology scan of the planet. And uh, you're notified that the only structure on this planet would have been a three and a half year long trip on foot. So would you like to use the ship to go there instead? I don't want to have to <laughs> land it again. <laughs> you can, if you've done it once, you can do it twice. Uh, okay, let's go. The, the better part is that you could have scanned it from orbit. <laughs> I just yeah, thought we knew where it was. You knew where the planet was. You were zeroed in on it. Oof. I wanted to land where the house was, and I just assumed. So, like, uh, you know I'm sorry I didn't say. think of it. I'm sick. <laughs> <laughs> um, again, it's a very short flight because the ship is extremely fast, uh, and you do see that it is like a castle in the cliffside. I thought it wasn't very fast in atmosphere. You go into orbit and fly over. <laughs> yeah, okay, fair enough. In your spaceship. Anyway, <laughs> it, it, it is mind. not very fast in orbit in in atmosphere. That being said, I don't even think this planet would have an atmosphere. Fair enough. Good thing we have bubbles. Yeah, yeah it is, isn't it? Um, you're welcome. Actually, no, this planet would have atmosphere. He likes trees. Um, what kind? Purple ones. Cool. Mm -hmm. Very. 
Okay. She likes purple. Um, what a guess. But so you get there, you park a decent distance away, just in case, right? And then you make a dex check to park because there's no park. park uh, You're parking on rough terrain. Can I get advantage because I did it so well last time? You can get advantage because Nami could help you. Yeah, fair enough. Refuses to help, disadvantage. Oof. Yeah. Actively harms. Oh my god. Did you roll nat 20 again? Yeah. Oh. Oh, and yeah. not an 18. Yeah. Yeah, you ain't no problem. Blessed. Damn, like, so, no, actually fucking pilots. You don't have to worry anything about anything. I'll make you a no. deal as well. Yeah. If you make one more nat 20 dex check while piloting this thing, I will give you proficiency in space sparing. You. Holy shit. <laughs> Do it now. I, I was like, just raise it, land it again. You have one in 400 <laughs> to one in, like, 8,000. Anyway, um, okay. yeah, so you guys have parked. Uh, you can leave out the back. <coughs> nice. Is that what you guys do? Yeah. yeah. Okay, so you all just leave the ship? Uh, With the bubble? I, uh, we can't leave down. Like, you mean down, right? Below. Yeah, you have to go, yeah, you have to go down to below the and out the back. Yeah. Yeah, Wait, yeah. are the alien guys still with us? I'm guessing yeah. they're yeah, they're trainer on the ship. there. I guess if we leave, they're probably gonna steal. So what are you doing? No, they said that they were gonna. We have to. We're manhunting. So what are you doing? Staying here. Yeah, they said they already said that they were just gonna watch the ship. Can we test that one? That I don't think we should. It's fine. Like I don't. It's whatever. Passwords. It's whatever. <laughs> It's whatever, we get stranded on a strange alien planet, no problem. I guess we can try and teleport back if we have to. Guess I have objects from there. Is there a problem with us staying here? No, not really. Awesome. Uh, you know how to pilot the ship? Them. Just need to be careful. Do we know how to what? Pilot the ship. No. Then I don't care. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <She leaves. laughs> okay, so you all leave. And I've got a new map. <coughs> Noah's Patreon subscription. Oh, hell yeah. It's hard what? to follow the subscription this... when I'm like literally that guy who subscribes for a month, downloads everything, and then fucks off right off. Yeah, I mean, that's, that's the risk. That's how that works. <laughs> to be oh, fair, I pay for the screen. higher tiers where they actually let me download everything at once. Yeah, there, uh, that makes sense. They expect I'm going to do it then. What? There's nothing wrong inherently with doing that. If you yeah. need the service just once, then that's, that's uh, the yeah, point. literally how the service works. Yes. Oh, I'm glad this works. Okay, cool. <laughs> we did it, Reddit. We did it. Sure. Yeah, I have a shitload of maps and tokens and stuff now that I need to somehow share. Oh no, Shrade's house. Why oh no, oh, it's his house? That? Has he been to our house? Are we like now just... I don't see that. Place? I just saw the name of the map called Shrade's house. Yep, it's called Shrade's <laughs> house. Cafe oh. de Shrade. Sorry. Purple. And purple. Does the house taste purple? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, for sure, dude. Purple. I feel like Sheree would have liked the dragon people planet because it's also purple. Yep. You were here? We are indeed here. Time for us to move on so we can not be here for long. Mm hmm. Yeah, I cast prestidization. Yeah. <laughs> what spell casting type are you using for that? Uh, Brute force. Yeah, with the willpower one. Okay, cool. Sheer power will. 
Psionics, got it. That's exactly it. <laughs> um, okay, that's a big hole over there. Right? Does looks that like just it, dip yeah. in? Yep, certainly looks like it. Does the kitty fit between this? Yep, that is a two by two. Okay. Does it does it actually go into like nothingness? It falls very down far deep into like, In, like a weird nothing. star like liquid. Really? It looks more like it's potentially the water is just reflecting space above it. Oh, okay. You want me to test it out? Jumps in. No. Yeah. Falls uh, to your death because it's hundreds of feet down. I can turn into a, a goldfish. Don't worry, I'm a goldfish. Yeah, it'll still kill you. <laughs> let's let's just count the parameters first. The per the parameters, not the parameters. Parameters, yeah. Parameters. Parameters. I mean, he's probably just inside. I don't think there's anybody else here. It's pretty dead outside of the trees. I mean, Haru, from where he's standing, can see the two small tunnels right. into the mountain. Yeah, up above. Oh so, yeah. Right. There's this cave as well. Right here. There's also wait. Oh, hey, is, is this window oh, open? Yes, the windows are all open. You can see inside. Uh just seems to be like kind of a small garden foyer room. I found oh. there's a staircase in this cave. Mm hmm There's a what? Oh a staircase. In in here. Oh. Oh that's a path. Okay. Oh, yeah, that is a path. Or just just take us. Go up the stairs? Sure. Up. Uh, okay, well, now the question is more pertinent. Does Marissa fit through this gap? Uh, Marissa would not fit up there. She could fit okay. uh, through that gap into that little cave that you're in, but, but not she up. can't go up the stairs. Okay. Upstairs is a five-foot-wide gap. I'll oh, leave I her get... there. I'll leave her inside the cave. Oh, get it. I get it. There's a cave here, and these staircase leads to that, but there's something also as well. These caves. This is like an overhanging part. Yeah, it's like an overhang. So, so here, I'll I'll drag you people up that are following Nami. I'm assuming that oh, yeah. yeah, don't don't go through the cracks. You can't fit. Well, okay, uh, you you can fit. I I can. I'm just saying. So I'm just saying that really. there's just the exact same as what we were just in. It yes, is the it overhang. is the exact same. The reason that it's small slots is because you're supposed to look through the small slot. Yeah. Hmm. I can I can probably fit. That's, That's where we a door. The door is not working. It's open. Can Doug yeah, cast no. knock? Not open. Doug what? Cast knock. Doug, yeah, Doug cast knock. Sure. What kind of knock are you using? Okay. Forceful one. <laughs> Cool. It's unlocked. No, I, want, I want to know. Oh, what hell yeah! Uh, see, it worked, Douglas. Your knock worked. Uh, yeah. So he, if it's unlocked, he just swings it open. Yeah, go for it. Oh, sure it. Shit. Oh How's shit! Cool, buddy? I'm not much of a fan of uninvited guests. We're not inside. Knock knock. Well, he knocked. I did knock. Take. <laughs> <laughs> I take out. I take out my halberd. Okay. So you're coming in to just kill me in my own home? That's your plan here? Some kind yes. of home invader? Yes. Yes. I mean, we could do it somewhere else if you prefer. No, here's fine. And then uh, he snaps his hand and Mabu appears next to him. Mm. And he pulls a dagger out and puts it to his throat. Oh, no! Mm. Another Wait. step forward and there's a dead kid on your hands. I look at Val and I say, Val, is he proficient in illusory magic? He 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 is, but also Why the hell would Mabu be here? I just brought him here. Is how how's he looking? Is he looking confused? Mabu looks very scared. Oh fuck. It Ma Ma Mabu where did, do you know where you came from? I was with uh, I was with Akuma and Bushi, and we were looking at a house, and then I just appeared here. Hey, lovely, oh, lovely. Can you, can you call Bushi real quick? No, it's fine. Um, 
I just want to confirm something. Uh, you have the call ball, and I think Fushi is just in the call ball. Do I have? I don't have the call ball. You're the one you that has the hot uses it, so you're the one that has it. Oh, I thought I put it back in the bag. But... Okay, clearly I, mean... I haven't made my point, so um, I'm just going to do this now, and he just chops off one of uh, Mabu's hands. Oh, Jesus. Mabu is in a lot of pain, uh, uh, and kind of like grabs it to stop the bleeding, and he goes, uh, Ten seconds, you turn around and leave, or I kill him right now. Go on, bye. See you. Oh, bye -bye. well, Val, Val, Val's bye -bye. back it up. Uh, <laughs> Fuck, Doug, well. Doug, please. Uh, move out of the way. <laughs> you can pass through me. Have a good night. Are you just gonna stay? Uh, have a good night. No, I'm just closing the door. I'm just closing the door. <laughs> Um, uh, after a few seconds of the door being closed, uh, oh, you guys do hear a, a distant sound of magic whooshing away. Mm. Mm. Oh. Val, there's no way he has your husband. Uh, oh, wow. uh, no, it's very possible. Uh, the reason why I wanted you to call Bushi is to make sure that is Mabu actually oh. there. Yeah, we can call oh, him no. now. Just can you call them. Yeah, just call him now. Just call Mabu. Can you call, the, call Mabu specifically. I mean, why not? Like, yeah. So Mabu picks up after a little bit because he's getting medical attention for his missing hand. Yeah, that. Yeah. Hmm. All right, that's like that. I'm not all that surprised. Yeah, not surprised. <laughs> Hi. What do we do? Um, Sorry about that. Why does he do that? He's not a... exactly a nice man. I didn't say why, I said how. How? Oh, no, I don't know. He... is also a very powerful man. I don't know what he can do. I don't like him. So we can't fight him, he's just gonna keep taking hostages. Perhaps. We take him by surprise, maybe. We don't have that, uh... There's magic that can prevent that. <laughs> it's like an 8th level spell. Yeah, it's an anti-magic field. We'll just put him in It also that. takes, yeah. what? An hour to cast? I have no idea. Warding? Well, just, just, put, just cast anti-magic field and just hug him. You could cast anti-magic field, yes. <coughs> I mean, it also makes it harder for us to kill him, but, um... It would just prevent him from using magic. He's a magic -y guy. Yeah, do you want me... I, I can literally cast anti-magic field. I can just swap one of my spells to cast anti-magic field. No, but it's it's target itself, right? So you'd have to... Yeah. You'd have Is to be, target like... Itself? Yeah, it's target itself. Target. Yeah. Yeah, that's... It's the lamest part of it. It's yeah. self-target. Mind you, I think it's really funny uh, to strap the wizard to the back of a barbarian um, and just have them cast it. Because <laughs> that barbarian well, is immune to most Mommy things. would like to stand on top of my shoulders as, or piggyback or whatever she can. Yeah. I want to make the comment that like we become significantly less efficient because we have a lot of magic items and spell Stay casters. out of the area. Well, no, but we can't cast things into the area either. Yeah. A plus three magic weapon is still plus three in a in a it's not. anti magic field. It's not. It no. is. It's just a what is plus three. The it plus says three is still there. Anti magic it... field says the magical properties of items within it are suppressed <laughs> while they're within. It's it. still a weapon, but I it doesn't have any wrong. magic effects on it anymore. But also, we also are ignoring wrong. the fact that what happens if he just moves out of? There? Yeah. No. The thing is, we need to be able to like oh, yeah. hug him. And like stay on him. I don't have a good answer to this. You want? Do you want to explore his house? We have a, we have <laughs> do you want to just house? explore his house? We could try yeah. talking. It's because he's there. Well, we clearly, we clearly went in there killing him, so he knows that. So why talking to him is not going to change anything. Uh, I mean, Val didn't agree to that, but it also feels like it's probably the best choice. What else do you want to do? Just have a nice picnic with him? Well, I wanted to, like, figure out goals 
and like the fuck. And sometimes in this world, you just not you just don't ask questions, and you just gotta do it. Do you know where his kids are? Who his? Yeah. Presumably. Presumably. Yeah. Uh, yeah, he's, he's a father. <laughs> Apparently. Apparently. I mean, he's been around a while. I have to assume. Do you want to go explore his house? Sure. Just go uh, around then. Maybe we can find something in there. <sighs> Thing is, he knows we're here, so he might, you know, spy on us. That's or worse. Funny. Also, we're currently talking outside one this. door away from his where his cur currently is. He could just be listening to us right now. Well, he knows we're confused. It doesn't matter. <laughs> All right. So, if I'm to, are we considering the weapons you gave me artifacts when they say artifact on it? Oh. Mm, yes, we are. Then they still work in the anti-magic field. They do still work in the anti-magic field. <laughs> I'm failing the codex works, but it doesn't matter because all the spells that comes out of it will not. Oh, wait, doesn't that mean charade just works? Yeah, probably. <laughs> so it doesn't matter. I mean, you can't spell cast in it still. That's unless is, I mean, yeah, I guess. What I assume is grabbing people. So and... I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna ask, uh, just a general question for you. Do you guys know that charade is a magic user? No. Yes. Maybe. No. It's not really. Have we not seen him use magic. Before? We've seen him use magic, but we've never actually we've seen, seen him cast him spells or perform something of magic. Yeah. Certainly. It could just be a mute. It just just be. Immune to it because like he's just what is he just is he just a rogue is he just a rogue? <laughs> you, I would just say that you guys know that magic has <coughs> stringent forms on casting. Generally, unless you're a sorcerer, and he has never cast a spell ever in your presence. He has just <laughs> made things happen. He has just made things happen. Ah. Things that defy logic, like creating magic items on the spot. Also artifact level well, items. Yeah. True. Just point the misfire bullet on him. No, that's, that's the thing. That my, my thought was just like, if we just take the, the gun that always uh, succeeds at firing, and the bullet that always misfires, and then just fire them. I think he dies? You want to kill think, us all. I also, I also think whoever is nearby dies too. <laughs> Depends how far the planet is from every, anything else. We don't know how- I don't know what the nearby is in this case. <laughs> also, you don't know how big the black hole will become. <clears throat> I know one of the, uh, <clears throat> classic big bad, uh, killing things in D&D &D Raw is to, uh, take a portable hole and a bag of holding and then just have someone kamikaze into it. Like, into the big boss, because that <laughs> just kills them. It kills you too. <laughs> it just sends you to the ethereal plane. I thought they exploded. No, it it just sucks everything nearby into the ethereal plane. Into the, the astral, astral plane. plane. Sorry. S M H, my bad. One of those two. Okay, so are you guys gonna head back down the stairs on the other side? Is that what you guys yeah. Uh, there. Oh, uh, yeah. Keep yeah. Like, are we just moving. are we just leaving him? <laughs> Now we're exploring the place. There's nothing I can do about it right now. Basically, yeah. Unless Val wants to dead become a widow, we're not going to be able to go after him at the moment. I just realized why Val said, do we know where his kids are? Because you were going to double hostage him. That's what you were going to do, wasn't it? No. No. <laughs> yes, it was. It absolutely was. I was, yeah. okay. <laughs> I was just <laughs> thinking about it because I was like, I'm sure Val probably sure thought about it, but I didn't. That negative about it. <laughs> Do, I don't remember uh, Charade's kids, so we know them. Yeah, we know them. Um, the uh, 
they they were in a group of two and then in a group of two technically but one body. So uh, no, it's three. Um, well, four, sort of. It yeah, but but met you them. met them in in a group of two. So you met the rebel lady, and then the big and guy. The big guy. Oh yeah, the guy that's immune to like damage, right? Like, Basic damage. Yeah. And then you met Diego by himself. Yeah. All right. Uh, who is two people? In one body. Uh, Haru. Yeah. On the other side over there, you feel a breeze. Like, on the other side of this wall here? Yeah, like that wall, you feel a breeze coming through it. You can get your cat back can if I, you so want. Uh, can I, like, push through? Yeah. Cool. It's an illusory wall. Gotta hit it with your sword. No, you just walk through it. Oh. Oh my god. It just leads oh you god. back outside. Pointers. Yep, Ooh. that's all it does. Just a little. So expect illusory walls, I guess. I'm gonna be. I got you. No. Sure. Going to remove mine. I'll just become like a Dark Souls person. Just <laughs> just start like bumping wall. into the walls. Yeah. Uh, you can. The illusory walls function like that in this game. Val, I can make it so that he can't attack for a few seconds if we want to try to get Mabu away if he tries to do that again can we even do that Does that work doug can literally do that uh we could just teleport in dimension door and then just do it so long as it's not hostile yeah you could just go in and teleport him out if you need that's to. true yeah <laughs> If he tries to do it again. I, no, but then he could I, just... Okay, unless... okay. If if he can grab Mabu from literally a different planet, he can grab Mabu from across the room. Yeah. Can you send him in your demiplane? It, hey. I could put him in the it demiplane. Is, it is still an action for him to teleport someone to his location. If you were to actually, like, start a fight with him where he wasn't, like... Because you guys walked in and started to approach him, so he's like, got it. You're trying to kill me? Boom. Here's Mabu. So, he set it up because you guys gave him time to Gave him stuff. time? Yeah, no, it's like, it took him time to do that. I guess but I could just put is... them in the demi-plane. Put him in a place that he can't reach? Also, he wouldn't say that out loud, he would just say that to Val, like, in her yeah. ears. I don't know if he can hear... Loud, like yeah, so she has big ears. Uh, Can I make it over to there? Do you think? No, that so yeah, that's, that's awesome. like oh, that's, the that's, same yeah, location. Sorry. Yeah. yeah, that's just like the the bottoms. Level. That's just like beyond his house, and it doesn't matter. Yeah, 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 yeah that's fine. I'm being a dork. Okay, where else did we get? There's, there's this. So all this we can yep, go. Those in. are the doors. So as soon as you open that door, guess who it is? Sumima san. Oh, okay. I said leave. That doesn't mean go around and come through the front door. That means it's, leave the premises. It's a nice architecture. I is run there in? Uh, the second you I walk can't. through the door, he'll teleport Mabu in. Oh my hands. god, so poor that's boy! That's what you're trying to do. Is like, that is that what we're trying to do? No, no. I was going to. I just shut like, the door. Yeah, what? Like, how else are we gonna do this? I don't. I don't know. <laughs> How else are we supposed to start a fight with a homie that's not gonna let us fight him? Uh, do you wanna, do you wanna just pull a lot of cards from the deck? <laughs> we can pull a card. Do what you are you trying to, to, pull? Like, what are you a, trying to do? What there's Game do? Master in here. It's essentially <clears throat> the uh, it's essentially the deck of many things. So it could be so good, really bad. bad Okay. Or really good. To be fair, I think most of the pulls in here are not bad. I will note this, Isabel. Every card has a chance to come up upside down up or upside inverted. Down. inverted. And inverted is always bad. Can I make a suggestion? Huh? Power word stun. How much HP does that have? I don't. 150 hit. Oh, or fewer. I read it's more. Yeah. It's oh, definitely yeah. oh, fewer. More. It doesn't work. Definitely more. <laughs> <laughs> there's also say, uh, there's also hold monster. Um, Is he a monster? Oh wait, do I have glibness? Do I have? Did I take that spell? Who 
I hope right. you fucking didn't. Huh? <laughs> that spell sucked. No, but like I might have taken it for the meme because it didn't really matter. <laughs> I have suggestion. How about don't? <laughs> I mean, if I was, Super like, precision. you know, a better caster, and I thought he could actually, like, fail it, I would try to compel him into a duel. Compel duel? Yeah, you know what, fair enough. <laughs> but, uh, I don't know, what are you doing <coughs> today, Nami? Yeah, what's your other role, Nami? Oh, he just beer bead. Oh, true. Yeah, I um, I think hold monster could work, but he'd have to fail that, right? Again, I have something that just makes it so no one can do mean things oh, to yeah. each other. Oh for yeah. Oh yeah. A single turn or more. The next like could be more than one turn. So no mean you things. Can get him out. It honestly, it is fully astounding to me that you guys aren't even attempting to just try and talk to him. It's just you have to bust in here and attack this guy right away. Uh, yeah. No other options. Is that you want us to talk to him? Also, you change. You could your... try. You changed your. Rather than not. Yeah, my your profile Haru... picture is him. Yeah. <laughs> yeah he changed it a while ago. A while ago. A while ago. Yeah. Haru as a okay. person would not be interested in talking, but like he's not gonna. He wouldn't stop other people. I really talking. wanted. Well, but that's the thing. That's why you guys don't really want to talk to him, right? I, I asked before getting off the ship. Are we killing him? Yes. We don't have to talk to him. <laughs> yeah. Well... That's that's fine. It's just you know. <clears throat> problem solving. Okay, I wanted to talk to him. Say, Look, can you peacefully just disappear, leave this? Ex no, but the thing existence? is, like, okay, so here's Not... here's the thing that I don't know. What do we want to happen from like him dying? Like, what is the goal here? Know, I'm not actually sure. <laughs> he's evil. He's evil. I don't know if he's evil. I mean, he did just chop off heart of uh, Mabu's hand. Yeah, but Val would do that too, but maybe not with Mabu. But like, yeah, and you're evil, <laughs> and you're also evil, Val. So what's your point? The the point I'm making is, like, is this this guy like any worse than like some of the other guys we've met? In that, can we just dip? Like, not dip, but like. So I will remind you. I believe the thing that instigated you guys coming to talk to him again was mm -hmm. specifically one of the seven sins said you know he probably wants to become real so if you leave him alone and let him do that he'll probably we be able to go to the real world but we would need to talk to him or confirm that yeah yeah okay so that that's why uh i was i was looking for that because i was just trying to figure out why we were here any in the first place, other than okay. we just want to kill Charade. Okay, so we we talk. Which granted him. is totally fine. You can want to kill him. That's kind of what I'm aiming for. Which I was gonna say, to be honest, like I had also forgotten the reason, but I knew as Haru would just want to kill him. <laughs> yeah. Um we've there's so many people on this planet that told us Charade is not a good person. You need to go and kill him. Like, multiple people that don't even know each other are oh. saying, this man needs to die. Please. Oh, by the way, that Max. Yes. Advisor on him. Oh, yeah. I could. Yeah. That's a good get idea. That ID. Okay, so we talk to him, we get some information out of him, we <laughs> advise him at the same time, and then we <coughs> instigate him. And then he says, what the fuck are you doing? <laughs> Shut off, visor. Okay. Well, he may he may or may not know what that does. I, I don't know. So 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 the main thing we're looking for right now is uh let me let me questions for owl bitch. <laughs> okay. Uh, so clown. we need to make sure we don't come in with weapons drawn because he's probably just going to do the exact same thing and again. And like, so just to remind everyone, as people. Knocking on someone's door is generally considered a polite way to enter their home. I'll just throw that out there. Don't we, you don't have to listen to me. We did knock. <laughs> what do you mean? We did no, knock. No, you literally went upstairs, opened the door, and he was there. And he knocked. <laughs> anyway. 
he's I knocked, but he did say it's it's unlocked, and I'm like, okay, mm-hmm. then I open it. Yeah. So I didn't wait for the, <laughs> the curious <laughs> response. I just knocked and entered. That's oh, breaking and entering. I'm just freaking <laughs> just breaking and entering. I, and I'm not saying that Charade would be the person to answer a knock, but it is the polite thing to do. Okay. To knock and wait. Uh, Doug would say to Val, all right, Val. Yes. You're going to have to try to talk to him. So he doesn't do that I really again. do wish I took glibness. That would have been so fucking nuts. <laughs> knock, knock, and just ask if we can talk to him. Okay. To me, my son. Like, sorry. Uh, let me let me just as Isabel prep some questions <laughs> so that like I don't okay. lose track of the bit. Um. Yeah. So. Well, we can hold the fact that uh, Sheree wants to go to the real world, and me and Haru have been to the real world. And Iran, I think. Yeah, well. So we can hold uh, hold that against him. Okay, so what do you know about the real world in general, just as an opening question? Can you send Paru Mabu back, please? (laughs) (laughs) If you're Uh, so powerful. Mabu is back now. God, he's probably gotten so much, like, motion sickness. (laughs) If you're so powerful, why can't you go to the real world yourself? Right now. Apparently it was easy for us. Um, <laughs> it, was, it was easy for us, so why can't he do it okay. any time? Uh, right, so there must be a reason it's hard for him. Yeah. Why is it hard for you? Maybe he's native to this pl- this place and he oh, actually Also, came. also, Ra- Rainbow Parasite? Wait, no, we know he doesn't. We know he's he came here a while back. Also, we are right. all native, and we were yes. able to go to you the You guys world. are also all native to this. Yeah. And it wasn't that hard. <laughs> But he's not native, no. right? We know he came. No, he is not native. <clears throat> oh, Charade's there is bo- Charade's probably dead on the other side. That's why he can't. So, so I will, I will note a few things uh, of importance for you. So, something that no one has really noticed, but I mentioned, is uh, you all know that Charade was a part of Game Master. Yep. Mm-hmm. How would Charade have entered this world if Game Master is also here and the number of people that have entered doesn't include both Charade and Game Master entering oh, separately? He split coming in here and needs to leave with the two? Like, the, he, to leave, he actually has to like leave with Game Master as one? Maybe. Might so he can't that. he can't halfway through leave? Although didn't wasn't that the whole thing that he absorbed Game Master at the end of our fight? Did he? I thought no, he did. He just know. said Game Master would leave. Oh. Yeah. Game Master just agreed to leave when uh. he lost. <laughs> okay, that's fair. And then he's disappeared and you haven't seen him since. Well he's dead now. We know that? He's because he's not he's on the he's card. On the card. Oh, oh shit. F. F. But yeah, I, I feel like Charade would know stuff about the Rainbow Parasite too, unrelated to the Charade thing. But like, <laughs> that is a secondary problem to the reality ending things. Alright, write that down, write that down. I wrote it down, <laughs> I wrote it down. Um, do you have any questions about that specifically that you want asked? I just thought it would be something I should bring up, by the way. I, I just feel like it's something you guys probably should have thought a bit more about. Yeah, we're too stupid to figure it out ourselves. Oops. I tend to take a lot of these things at face value just because of habit. Um, <laughs> uh, yeah. Any, any other questions for the purple man? No? I don't know. I'm eating pizza. Cool. Bad joke. But no, I think that's about it. Honestly, the, yeah, the actual <coughs> and our reasoning behind the <coughs> Man, I wish I heard what you said, Noah, but there were two so people so dying sorry. in chat at the I'm same so time. Sorry. <laughs> sure. Well, like his actualization would be the big thing to ask about. Right, him becoming. And why, real. why he doesn't he just leave <clears throat> if, just if he's it. so powerful and oh. stuff? Okay. And also, no bitches? Question mark. No bitches. 
Knock, knock. You know that he had a bitch. Yeah, I know. No uh, longer. No longer bitches. Bitch. No longer it's, bitches. It's in the in the background, not like, not 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 acknowledging the fact that you just said that. Do 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 do. Yeah. Oh yeah, because you're the reason that no longer bitches. Uh huh. <laughs> I guess my question is. I remember hmm. stuff sometimes. <laughs> I guess my question uh, question I would ask is also why he wants to go outside. Because this world is ending. Mm. Yeah, but why, why it was do you the... have those weird things on your cheeks? What do those mean? <laughs> <laughs> why are you a purple parasite? We've only seen red, blue, and green. <laughs> why do you do this? Well, I... Wait, I'm opening... The, 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 I just want to see how he looks like again. Uh... Do, you want, do you want me to send the... the, to the he has toast? a sun and a moon? As yeah, it's a sun and a moon. And on his cheeks. So why yeah, do you look like that? Oh, okay. <laughs> Yeah, you also, I think the biggest weird thing about him being a parasite, like if you forgo the fact that he's got purple eyes, which is not normal for parasites, why isn't he devoid of color? Every other oh, yeah, parasite because he's not feels like fully black, but he's white. White. The weirdo. All right, we got it. Okay, we got we got our questions. White points of. All right. All right. Let's do the door. No, no you just knock. Right. Knock. Knock through the door again. And Charade exasperated. Charade, do you, do you mind so, if I open so this knock. door? I have some questions. Uh, after a few seconds, he opens the door and he goes, Ah, oh, hello. So glad of you that you could stop by. Thanks for knocking on my door. And then not kicking it open. <laughs> well, ignore the last ten minutes. I'm just that gonna... sounds like a good idea. I'll be I'll be uh. in the back because he probably doesn't like me very much. Yeah. To be honest. <laughs> I don't think he likes that anybody. Fun okay, okay. I think probably, he probably me less. Like more than the rest of us. I know. He probably <laughs> likes me the least currently at this current time. Maybe. I did kick in this door. So kick. what do you want? You did, you did kick his There's some questions. Do you want to chat over to you or something? <laughs> you want to talk about it? <laughs> And I'm assuming that I'll be making tea then. If you don't mind, I have some if you want some tea from where we're from. I've had plenty of your tea. Lovely. But what kind of tea is yours? Do you have? I just Purple. Have the ones that I like. <laughs> Purple tea, yeah. Purple. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> Taste purple. I mean, if all the plants here are purple, then it's going to be purple tea. <laughs> Um, this small adobe of, uh, of mine doesn't actually have a table of mine, doesn't have a, a dining area. But, uh, uh, you, you need to eat. You a spot to sit here. No. Uh, lovely. We're on a push in. Uh, okay. Just have me zoom out and there we are. There you go. Um, <clears throat> find a spot to sit and I'll get tea ready. Douglas, I think it would be. I think it would be nicer if you weren't on Marissa. <laughs> oh yeah, true, true, true. Sorry, just I'll leave her out. Robot. Was it kind of oh, like wearing a hat indoors? Actually, can he's not out. attuned to the hat anymore. Oh my god. Um, but yes, you guys can all find a spot to sit. It's a comfy place. Uh, there's a lot of like nice things here. The little gardens are quite pretty. They are. Um. And then he he serves everyone tea, and it's fine. I mean, it's it's a tea. There isn't too much flavor to it. If you want flavor, you add cream and sugar. Mm -hmm. And he goes, "Okay, start asking your tedious questions." So, what do you know about the real world? Well, I was from there, obviously. So plenty. But like its current status. There isn't much of it left, is there? No, it nope. looked to be a desert. With two buildings. Yeah. Desert on um, fire. Well, you know, stars die. We heard you wanted to leave. Fire. Say again? We heard you wanted to leave here I to go do. I'd out. love to go back to the real world. But why? But why? Because I know how to fix it. Oh. How do you fix it? You take the artifact to the other tower. Mm. 
Why does that work? Uh, Say again? Why would that work? It's obvious. The artifact creates worlds. It's simple. Did you not figure that out when you went there? I didn't. Right, sorry. The spider did. And so did the jellyfish. Yeah. I think that well, the dog did it. as well. Were you spying on us? He always spies on us. I can see whenever an entity comes or leaves the artifact. Hmm. What happens to this world if you move it? I don't know. Hmm. But that's not my concern. It's not my world. If okay, moving but... it to the tower fixes everything, why wasn't that the first thing people done? Because they didn't know at the time. How did you find out then? Research. Pretty simple. How do you research something like that in here? Because in here is where all the code is. Huh. What's code? <laughs> it's the parameters by which this world exists. Hmm. Oh my gosh, I just smelled lemon for a second. That was very exciting. I'm sorry, I just got... <laughs> I do have lemon yes, for the tea, lemon. if you would like. Pardon? I do have <laughs> lemon for the tea, if you would like. Sure. <clears throat> oh, Why well. is it so difficult for you to go out now? I don't know. Every time I attempt to leave, it just gives me an error. Hmm. What does, does the error say? say? You can't go because you're not complete, or you're not an entity. It just gives me an error, and uh, it points to a location in the coding. I don't understand yet. Uh, do you mind if we check something? We're not going to do anything brash. Go ahead. Uh, Doug, Pfizer. Pfizer. Uh, sure. Uh, I turn on the visor. All right. You get an error. Activate. I activate it. I get an error? You get an error message when you look at him. Oh, he's a virus! <laughs> Would make sense? Who is looking at Well, if he's a virus and, world and he says he's from uh, the outside just, world... Does it just say error? Or is there no, there is a... a full message, but you don't understand what it says. Uh, do you want to let Dog take off? Uh... <clears throat> Doug would literally say, I have a feeling if I let him take over, you're going to start a fight. Uh, I know that. Every try talking to him? What a bird. Yeah, how about, can, 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 you, can you ask can the, I, the more? Wait, to be let fair, bird take over? <laughs> uh, would you like to attempt to talk to Bird, which you have talked to multiple times yes, now since he's been I here? I would, actually. Then? What yeah. would you like to say to him? I would like to ask Tyr, um, Tyr, you know who Charade is, right? I don't know him as he currently is. In fact, he is different from what I know of Charade. Is that right? From my memory, <sighs> originally the first time I saw a person like them, they were a woman, and they were part of Game Master. What? <laughs> I assume nobody else can hear this except for me, right? It's in your head. Yeah, I, I assume the I assume the what was out loud. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <It is>. What? <laughs> huh? Classic duck. Wait. So he was a girl first, and he's like he's not looking at charade, but he's pointing at charade. You know what I mean? <laughs> he's like looking it, on the ground into the middle the distance, ground, but he's like yeah, and then he's pointing at charade. He's like. You mean this was a woman before, not the same person? Yes, I believe that that's correct, or at least the time that I briefly met them. I mean... Can you tell me what's wrong with him now? Do you know? Uh, if you're referring to the error message, it says something about not being, like, a full file. Like, it's a partial file format. Oh yeah, because Game Master is the other part of the file. 
So I'm assuming that the system is really struggling to figure out how to eject them. It doesn't know if it should make a new body or if it should try and put him back into the old body that he's a part of. Meow. You're very helpful, Tyr. Thank you. You're welcome. Charade, I know what your problem is. Oh, dear. There's a hole in your there's a hole in your heart. <laughs> no. Huh? No, there isn't. <laughs> Trust me, there is. What a way to say it. Can you try to communicate that information? <laughs> I oh, shit. don't know what you're told, but I assure you, the problem is not that there's a hole in my heart. I am much happier the way I am now than I was back then. Okay, well, you may be happier, but that's the reason you can't leave. Okay. right please yeah did he say did he did he look like he was gonna say anything when i called him like a woman or somebody else uh if you you specifically referred to uh Shrey being a woman in the past so yeah. you wouldn't have cared what you said oh, okay yeah but he oh i hmm mm. Shrey. yes Is uh, is you being part of Game Master a sore spot for you? Yes. That's why I didn't want to go back. Yeah. Okay. I get it. You're. So sorry. Who are the people that aligned with Game Master? Because you're literally anti-trans if you did that. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Nah. <laughs> uh... <laughs> okay. Her yeah. goes from good to evil in one fell. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> My public image. No. <laughs> and then all of the we party got, got canceled on X. True. Anyway, it doesn't. It, there's an error, but it doesn't give me any other information. Like, like I said, the the you got the extra text from yeah, yeah, yeah. He just told you what it was. It's that he's yeah. basically an incomplete file, so he's like a corrupt yeah. file. I just need I I I just want to know if Charade is is part of Game Master or Game Master is part of Charade. Charade is part of Game Master. It's very okay, obvious. Sh that is obvious. This man is not actually someone. He is actually well, just. You can say it. I would say else. it's extremely incorrect to say that this person isn't a whole person. Yeah, this yeah, is a whole person. Sure. Okay. But this whole but, person is a part of a greater person. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And that's why he's hurt because he wants to be the bigger. He wants to be the the entity, okay. right? The he wants to be who he is now. Right. He doesn't care about Game Master. He doesn't care about his past. He wants to be <coughs> what he is now. Yes. Also, Isabel, and... if you weren't here when I said it, uh, Charade is trans. Okay. Just thought I'd let you know. That, I mean, that was I... kind of what people were getting at. I didn't know if you were here because you said BRB. Oh, yeah, no, I said BRB after that. And I was just like, look, okay, I mean, cool. I... Val gives no shits about but Also, <laughs> we know that Charade, like, Split from Game Master. Game Master's the original ish. And this one is now a new person trade. But he's not okay with the fact that he can't leave unless he becomes the person like the, the charade game the, master. The, the previous. Yeah, yeah, his previous. Well, if the person. error code is saying that it doesn't know whether or not to put back the old one or to make a new one, why not just tell it to make a new one? Wait, so like, I do have a question if I could. This man. What? Okay, do, do, dog, dog. Can can dog do it? Can. can... Okay, man. No, I, I'm asking. I'm asking something to him. In private, because I, I want to know. Oh, I, I see, I see, I see. I, I hear silence. <laughs> yeah, I know. Sorry. I'm messaging him oh privately. Oh my god, this guy is crazy all this time. 
Uh, um, Doug must be evil. You know, Doug must I'm surprised be that uh, horror seems to hold the most resentment for me when we're quite similar, you know? We are just... not haven't been a fan of how you've done things, is all. I mean, it takes one to hate one, right? Oh, shit. That's not how the saying goes, for <laughs> sure. It's a malaphor, it's fine. Um... Okay, so while while Dog is doing while Doug is doing his thing, no, no. <laughs> God damn it. Okay, so should is that information that you want to share? No, because because it's pertinent to whether we want Charade to continuously stay neutral at this current time instead of actively becoming hostile to him. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> no, you're 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 withholding information, so I don't. <laughs> no, I know, I'm just, I know you don't know what I mean, but you know what I mean. Right? You know we can. You know you can go. We can go outside, and you can tell us what we're not while well, he's not actively no, 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 hearing. No. Finish asking him your questions. All right. Um, Dog is just being a much more Dog's local silent. question. Uh huh. Um. So do you know that rainbow parasite that's slowly coming towards us. Safer? Yes. Yeah, yeah that guy. when he was in the real world. Lovely. He was. Do you know any any tips and tricks for how to uh get rid of him? <laughs> Just avoid him. It doesn't matter. He's not real. Nobody's coming you here. Mean he's not real. He's just some strange artifact put into the system. And sorry, when I say artifact, I don't mean he's a magical artifact and I can collect it. I mean that he's some strange thing that has been put into the system by someone else that shouldn't be here. He doesn't matter. So he's the virus. Yeah, that's that's a good way to put it. Seda is, seems to be a virus, but he was a real thing in the... in your universe. Yes, he was. Right. Yep. A horrible leader. He didn't like cause your your world to perish. No. Right. Our, the, no. How much do you know about space? We're new here. Uh, very little. <laughs> we, so we just got here. Stars, stars, the things that generate light, are burning balls of gas, and they can like, run out, basically. After a long time, they explode. Um, our universe is so old that all of the stars exploded. Why can't you just make new ones? No, you can't. Magic doesn't <laughs> work that way. Magic is a limited resource, and the more you use it, the less there is to go around. So by the time our universe was ending, it had been so long that there was so little magic that there was no feasible way to restart them. All universes come to an end. Did your world have magic? It did. Not much when I was around, but it had some. Do you know why humans are so powerful in this world? Because of the creator. He just made it that way. He just chose. Yes, he did. How come I there's like no human? Uh, so is the creator a human? <coughs> he is. Uh, At least. You know his name? I suppose he more was human. I wouldn't consider him much of a human anymore. Gotcha. You know who Seth is? Seth, that creature, I suspect, is one of the original creators of the artifact. The Codex? No, not no, the Codex. No, the, like, actual The one that artifact. we are Oh, the with. actual thing. Yes. Hmm. I suspect he might have even been one of the ones that helped to build that tower that the artifact leads you into. He knows too much to be some simple program. Where is the tower exactly? 
in the real world, just across from the one that you're in. So the other build? Yeah. The other it's build. It's the one that Haru went and looked at. Yeah. Right. How can something so important be so close to what to the artifact? Because How did it end up next to each other? Place. So uh this I think I might have explained to you guys before, but I'll mm -hmm. I'll reiterate it for you guys to remember. Um yep. this the tower and the artifact were always on this planet. And this planet was the last one left Surviving. as the universe started collapsing. It was basically mm -hmm. the last bastion. So it was just always there. So presumably whoever built it knew that it would be the last place to be affected by the collapse of the universe. Oh. Yep. Yeah, so they didn't choose this place. Like, they knew this place was going to be the one. Yes. All along. Okay. And presumably, every time the universe ends. It's always the same place here? That's the yeah. last one to survive? Yep. Yeah. It's Ooh. always the same two towers. Uh, okay. Is Do we know a place here? That has this two towers no. in this place? No. Uh, as far as you know, there is not a place like that. And Charade can confirm that for you. Hmm. Interesting. The tower in the artifact is merely outside of this world. In fact, the creators didn't include any buildings that look like theirs uh, inside the program. <laughs> You'd think that they might have to help give people a chance at figuring out how it works, but eh, who knows. And somebody did ask, do you know the creator's name, right? Yeah, I do. He doesn't. The only thing the creator has ever told me to refer to him as, other than the creator, is the Harvestman. Harvestman? The Harvestman? Yeah. What did they look like? They were just a shadowy figure that wore a cloak. <laughs> the DM... <laughs> the DM. I'm already in. I'm the game master. I'm, I'm oh, literally true. a game character. You're right. In You're already inside the game. Dark. True. Oh my god, it's death. <laughs> <clears throat> he was Any more very, questions, uh, Val? Mysterious. No, that's all I had. Uh like your fifth one. Oh. I stopped counting like an hour ago. Yeah, I know. Um I I feel like we could probably fix the real world relatively easily if it's just bring the artifact to the other tower. I guess we don't know what's gonna happen when we do that. Yes. But we could do it. Sorry, do, uh, Max might one stream second. in a second. Oh, uh, one okay. Second. Uh -huh. <laughs> oh boy. But hold, hold the horses. We're going in like three. Uh, hold or? Half speed. We're going in half speed now. Everybody. Jojo like time. Slowing down. <laughs> waiting hmm. I have a cat on me you put nice that together, Max? hell I think I understand but at the same time it's do you want to share with the class confusing. Do you want to share with the rest of the class? Um. No. Are you talking to one of the three animals in your head there, Douglas? What? What? Oh. Uh. No. No. I rolled deception. No. -uh. <laughs> I get uh, I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure I put all of. Uh, 
Yeah, yeah, he's got an actual insight roll. Dude, there's okay. no I way. Get, I, I, I get a one. Okay, a four. Okay, cool. He still beats you with flying colors with a natural one. Um, <laughs> so he's lying to me. That's cute. Mind to Sorry. <laughs> okay. He's asking. To, uh, he's asking him to clarify, because he's not uh, sure. Here, do you want me yes. to message you, or do you want me to <laughs> say it? Speak. You can say it. Okay. Oh, so to clarify, the artifact goes into a pedestal in the large tower, and then the people there can use the template of a world within the artifact to recreate the world outside into reality. Oh, lovely. Okay, so it's like a copy paste thing, so it's not actually destroying us. No, no, of course not. It could never destroy anything here. That would make no sense. And okay. you can't be destroyed or created. Oh man, I was about to throw some hands. Okay, for good. Yes, he looks at trade. He says, "Yes, yeah, sorry, I was, I was, I was speaking to them, but that's I'm because tear, right? Because he's the only one that's useful." <laughs> <laughs> You're not wrong. I, You're not wrong. I still really He's, like... He smiles smugly. <laughs> smugly. I really like that you call cat and dog cat and dog, but you call the bird by their name. <laughs> because, do you know why? It's because Tyr is actually... Helpful. And <laughs> is, is, like, is actually, you know, like helpful a person and... Well, yeah, interacting. They're talking to they, you. Because they're they willing... Because they willingly interact with you like a person, you treat them like a person. Yes, and then it, it is very funny. So <laughs> it's very funny because you say that, and I look back at the messages that Max has sent me, which is question to dog, and then does Tear answer the same question? He just <laughs> innately refers to the bird yeah. as Tear, and dog is dog. <laughs> it's really uh, funny yeah. to me. <clears throat> it's the second dog starts becoming more receptive to conversation he may he may change but not right now it's still dog cat's fucking off somewhere i don't know what she's doing so i you do, yeah you know also showed up to you like actually as a cat also pi also pissed me off as a cat for like <laughs> months i'm glad that she played her role of a cat efficiently <laughs> I will tell pushes, you, Mark. Pushes your magic like items cats. off. Nice, awesome. What the? <laughs> I don't really like cats. <laughs> I prefer dogs. <laughs> Anyways, no, I don't dislike cats. I just prefer dogs. That's fair. You just think cats are awful. Well, they're, they're like, they're assholes half the time. Or like 80% of the time. All the time, pretty much. Yeah. Pretty much, pretty much of the time. I closed the door to the office because I didn't want the cat bothering me. Eighty percent of the time, all the time. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Anyways, sorry. Um. Okay. Um. And if we can somehow fix your planet, fix our your planet, fix your your world, will you stop being such a bother? To the people in this world, please. What have I done to anybody? You no, just shit. cut the man's no. hand off. Yes, and what were you doing when I did that to prevent you from doing that? What what, what were you doing again? You were coming in to kill me, right? Yes, and then I efficiently stopped you. So before that, right? What have I done to anyone that you all haven't done worse at? Please. Ooh. Feel free to give an example. Is this true, Val? Yes. I'm not even just including Val. You unleashed a lich-powered no. griffin monster. No, like, is this true? Like, have we done oh. worse? Oh, no, no. We've, we've, cer we've certainly done worse. Well, you know what? No, I don't Are know that for sure. Guys? I don't know oh. that for sure. The On the sole We're basis of Charade has been around for much have. longer than we have. Charade could have done things that we don't know about. He's been around much longer than we have. Most of us. True, I'm, I'm mm -hmm. just 50 years old. 
No, you're you could not. have done you're anything. Like I'm not. I'm like six. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, Val's seventy. Which is fine. Or seventy-five now. Seventy-something. She I'm was seventy-three. Like now it's in her like mid twenties. <laughs> Isn't Haru like seventeen? <laughs> no, he's. Eight. Every time you ask, is he? Under the legal age, the answer is no. He's not. He's I thought a, he was like uh, nineteen. Okay. Like he's just like twenty something now. This is not a minor. Yeah. <laughs> I just always mines. thought he was a minor. Like I thought he started no, the campaign. No, Val is the only minor here. <laughs> Even though she's seventy four. Seventy. Uh, she started seventy three. Yeah, under a hundred. Well, it's Elf the same with Doug. Technically, Doug is not a minor, even though he was born like a few years ago. Yeah, born. He's a fucking no, yeah, robot. but it's the inverse of Val, right? Because Val is technically <laughs> yeah, not a minor, he had but all his information given to him, right? So like, he has all of he was compiled that way, right? Yeah, even compiled as a fifty-year-old man. Old. It's not my fault. I was just compiled, was compiled that way. As... <laughs> <It's> just... <laughs> yeah, he was created at fifty. So. <laughs> <clears throat> Ugh. Are you still going to try and kill me now? I mean, I See, never really wanted to. I didn't want to talk to him. This is why. Because okay, now there's so, no need to kill him. Uh, so, so Val is always of the opinion that if you can't kill it, well, no, don't don't try to kill it first. But you make use of the things around you. Meaning. You know, he's helped us more than he's hurt us. Look, Dog is is straight up just gonna ask uh, Tear, like out loud. Out like, loud. Tear. Do we do we need to kill him? Oh my god. I don't see a reason to kill somebody who isn't threatening you. Fuck. <laughs> he's like, I really wanted you to say yes. Hey, yes, dude, dude who gave yes. us, dude who gave us access to the peace ability. Should we kill this guy? No. <laughs> no. <laughs> no, of course not. <laughs> God damn it! Where's Cat when I need her? Steve would so be on board too. It's like, oh yeah, let's kill this fucking dumb clown. She's a bird. It's oh, a bird. God. The cat. The cat just swats at the bird. Okay. okay. <sighs> Fuck. Where's Gate Master? I don't know. He said that he would leave after we beat him in the fight, so he's probably gone. I'm making the assumption God. that he's dead. Likely. Oh, you're shit out of luck, then. Am I? Do you know where the cat is? Cat, what? Oh, the other one of those three stone robots. Out of curiosity, yeah. I, I'm not expecting a yes answer. I, I don't, I don't know. They haven't yeah. come or left from the system. I can tell you that much. Lovely. Dude, that's good. At could, least. could you open a way for us to get out of the system? I'd need a lot of power. Okay, but the answer is yes. How much? Probably the equivalent of about 50 ninth level spells. That's not too bad. Can we hire Sky for that? Would he have enough? Sky would be able to power it. He already told you he could. Yeah. yeah. So it's it's, it's very it's simple enough to just go back and do that. Yeah, but you don't think this man's already tried putting himself out? No, but he can't leave. We can leave. He can't. What did Tyr say about the artifact there, Doug? I'm assuming that's what you asked him about. Yeah, he said... The world would not perish for moving the artifact, but it requires this world as a template to create the new world outside. So if I were in this world, and you created a new world, I would be created with it. Yes. Yes. So then my initial assumption of helping this small party to do everything was correct. Yes. You're welcome. Now go on and hurry. 
I'd like to leave. I don't know. Mark, stop! No. <laughs> Are we Before supposed I die to kill him or not? <laughs> I am not telling you whether or not you should kill this character. That's up for you guys to decide. God I don't think we can reasonably yeah. do it. <laughs> Basically, like you don't think we can out outmatch him. I and kill him? I can tell you mechanically, <laughs> it's a hard fight, but it's doable. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Like I think that mechanically speaking, we can do it. But like I think I the losses okay. for Val are too much. She would kill you too. <laughs> I don't think that there's a. I don't think there's a mean, hey. There's any way we can kill him meaningfully. Wait, what do you mean by that? As I'm saying like, like if he... if you attacked him and he killed yeah, Mabu, he she would yeah, kill okay. you too. I see. I see. It's one of those like well, I may as well yes, kill Doug, you I both. Can kill now. You. You're very low, right? Die. <laughs> <laughs> He'd be a willing creature. Can he kill himself? <clears throat> kill me? Or uh, Mabu. Oh. Can he Mabu kill him? can heal, I... but he can't restore body parts. Yeah. Yeah, you're probably, that's probably your job, uh, Val. Uh, I can't even. Mabu again. For like another okay. year. We can fix him. It's fine. We can fix him. Just have Next year. He has, he has a way. Next year. It's a hand, and he has six of them. It's fine. <laughs> Why are you still white? We know all the parasites oh, are black, yeah. right? Yeah. What are you racist? You can't just ask what? people. Oh my god. A little bit. <laughs> He's xenophobic, but not racist. He's xenophobic, but not racist. What? Because I chose the body I'm in now, and this is how I want it to look. Douglas, is that okay with you? How come I the other parasites can't do that? Sure. Because the other parasites are normal parasites. They don't know how to program. Oh, I see. That makes sense. Are you a bug? Um, like, how are you able to do this? He's Neo I'm from The Matrix. To tell you. Oh <laughs> Can you... I don't want you to know. Can you... Well, I'd like to know how. <laughs> That's unfortunate. Uh... Could a codex do it? That <laughs> is one of the things that helps you do it, yes. How come you can just do it? Because I don't need the codex anymore. You it's are part of it. Anymore. Well, I guess Val has a life. So where's your now. codex? <laughs> we need it. I don't know. I think I returned it to the stupid place. I I guess it's one of the ones that were there before. Yeah, but... I guess if they're there still. Okay. Okay, that's good to know. Oh yeah, I guess that's another reason why we came here to see if we can get his codex. <laughs> well, and I, I don't have it. Yeah, I think his codex is in the temple. Yeah, that the, makes sense. In the wall. Do you want a cookie? Is it poisoned? No, it's just old. <laughs> How old? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm not actually sure. It's been in my bag for a little while. <laughs> I'll pass. Thank you for the offer, though. Gotta <laughs> kill this man with a diseased cookie. No, it's just stale. It's very stale. It's very. Stale. It's just hard tack now. <laughs> I mean, hard tack is He's edible, though. He's immune to being poisoned. That's good, at least. I had to double check that I did that for parasites. I'm pretty sure I did. Yeah, I did. Parasites are immune to being poisoned. Oh, I just listed her age at 74 Ooh. now. Goodness gracious. Okay. Man, Doug was so ready to come kill someone. Like, specifically him. Not specifically. Not, specifically him. <laughs> you wouldn't happen not... to be able to just give me a decanter of endless water, would you? Didn't you have one? Yes, but Moros ate it. I don't think he would just eat it. I think you fed it to him. Yeah. No, no, he ate it. I that passed. Is correct. <laughs> that is correct. So that is... you fed it to him. Okay. In that case, no, I'm not an insurance agency. <laughs> you wanna be? No. I. You can My just buy another one. My job would be to own a circus. Mm. Well, well, you're pretty powerful. Why can't you do it now? Because it wouldn't be real. Did, did any of this isn't real? 
Did breaking malice remove the evil from this world? <laughs> no, the malice is just where it started. Ah, uh, like lovely. It delete everything else. Well, it would have been nice. If it deleted evil, you wouldn't be here, Val. I'm neutral. <laughs> Thank you. Very the shots are fine. <laughs> uh. It's just like, I'm not evil. Besides, do you really think a world would be very interesting if there was no evil in it? Because I don't think it would be. Ooh, fair enough. Uh, yeah, we yin yang balance all that shenanigan. Huh? Oh, I have some universal no, I solvent. I totally to forgot. Evil sometimes. Do you, do you have uh the glue? What's it called? Sovereign's glue. Universal. No, solvent? sovereign's no. glue. Sovereign's glue. Sovereign glue. Sovereign glue. Yeah. No. No. Uh, Why? No, I was just wondering if you could give me some. Why are you asking for handouts like charity? <laughs> You're adventurous. <laughs> Go fucking buy it. It's just, <laughs> it's just so much more it. convenient asking... since you can oh, just it's generate. It's so easy to oh, get everything as charity, oh, you know. God. It's so much easier to Hey, do it's almost charity. inside your name. Charity, charity, charity. <laughs> charity. Charity? Really? <laughs> uh. No, the sovereign glue was just going to be for a joke. A joke. Can can we can we fix can we focus on fixing things and then playing practical jokes? Thank you. It takes a while to get back. Why are you going back? Wait, where should we go? I don't know. Don't you have other places to go? I wanted to fix Mabu's hand. Kill the other sins or something? They're already dead. No, they're dead, but their avatars are still in it. Yeah, whatever. It doesn't matter. It. it doesn't matter. What if it's it the does? Same. What, it's the what same if, with you. We've what if been they're told all, to kill you. What if they're all called the Seven Sins? Because, you know, they're bad people, and maybe they should come back to life when the world is recreated. Okay, and all of them told me to kill you. And we're not here out hey, currently seven, killing you. If seven evil people told you to kill one guy, would you do it? Yes, because it'd probably mean they're ev more evil than them. No, or, or they're good. good. Could be either one. Could be either or one. Or they just want to keep to themselves. Uh, I mean... Uh. You, were, you haven't been done that historically, but I guess you were now. I only didn't do it historically because I wanted to push you all along in your little adventure. And because I wanted to have some fun. See, it's important to have fun along the way. No, not for you. No, no, no. <laughs> I can't go fix the world, but you all can, so get on it. It's This is the same conversation we had, or the same ending point we had the last time we talked to him. Is he it? literally said, go save the world a second. Yep. Yes, this yep. is literally <laughs> the second time he says this. Yep. Just in different words, I guess, with more information. He just withheld a lot of information the first time. Doc, also, why did you... Like, you look like you're getting angry. Are you angry? Not... No, I'm not angry, I'm just... hit something? Frustrated. No! <laughs> I'm just frustrated, I... You should probably I back away from him before you do something you'll regret. Why is he closer to me? Uh, I don't like that. I don't like that. <laughs> What's he doing? It's like he's egging you on. I know time. he is. I know he is, but I know that he's also taking hostages, and I can't just I'm attack him. this man. I, mean, I can put just a... attack him. If However angry him, I am. At this point, he wouldn't be able to summon somebody. I know, quickly. I like... know, but there's no, there's no point in... Unless he really pisses me off, I'm not going to punch him. So, where are we going next? I don't know where you want to go. I'm not asking you. I can give you directions. <laughs> what directions to where? Yes. Okay, what? so the anger yeah. management place I know. Oh my god. Is okay, he, no he knocks him. He <laughs> Make an attack roll. <laughs> Why is Haru over there? Oh, he's just standing over there. Haru's just been over there. Just, he's been uh, over there this whole just time. Just my fist, right? Like a, a strength. Punch. Sure, unless you're hitting him with your halberd. No, no, he's he's oh punching him. 
It is so more satisfying. More like Strength plus regular yeah. armed attack. Uh, let's you see. get proficiency. You are unarmed. Yeah, I know exactly. With your um, sorry. I'm just gonna so that. athletics, <laughs> I think, would be the role. Yeah. Yeah. Douglas, I think you hitting him when when you're getting angry because he want he's recommending you an angry management is kind of proving your his point. It is. So Twenty six. Let me double check what he has for reactions because he has a bunch of them. Uh... You do understand we were here to kill this man, and <laughs> you're you're telling me you're telling him not to. No, nah, you. And didn't. then he's he's currently actively pissing him off more and more and he just he chose to come close to him this is <laughs> this is his own fault this is how Doug is, is uh he's asking for it on this he's asking for it so he punches him yep he does him. whatever minimum damage like the damage one plus us. strength so seven that's, seven. that's, that's a lot <laughs> Um, so you hit him. Can you make no, an insight fuck. check? Uh, sure. It's probably not gonna work, but I can try. Oh. Yeah. Feels pretty real. He goes, ow! Jeez. You hit like a truck. Can I, can I? It's a truck. Walks, no, he probably he looks says, real. He, he says, I'm sorry, and then walks, like, away. Out. At least out. He walks out. <laughs> so you walk out the door, and the second that you walk out the door, there's a charade here. He's a shit. He, and he's, he, he's, that's he's, punches him again. <laughs> he's petting Marissa. Oh, that's why I was wondering Jesus. why he was. Wait, I, that's why I was. I wanted to ask that. I was wondering why he was both here and above another floor. There's just two of them. Uh, what the hell? Well, Probably fucks guys. himself. What's it like punching an illusion? I, I felt real to me. Also, why are you pissing me off? Why do, what do you gain from this? I'm doing it because it's easy. I know it's oh. easy. <laughs> Um, and, uh, have a lovely yeah. day, Doug. Oh, he's, oh, he's so close to just taking out his weapon. Oh, <laughs> Val is uncomfortable. Uh, oh. that's, so that's why you were both in this floor and above floor, because there's two of you? Sure is. There All can right. be more. There can be as many as I want. Shadow clone jutes. How many, how many have you had at once? What's your record? That sounds like an inappropriate question. What's your record? Oh, I don't want What's to tell body how many men I've had at once. Jeez. <laughs> uh, no, see that, that Im Nami. No, Not see that that implies that implies that this is masturbation, and I'm going to start going now. <laughs> <laughs> the answer is seven. <laughs> if you how fuck your own work? clone, is it masturbation, incest, or why would I have sex with my own clone? I don't know, you can do anything. That would stop. imply that I'm in command. Stop asking him, stop asking him <laughs> stupid questions. He's gonna answer similarly stupidly, okay? Stop it. Sometimes you gotta ask the stupid questions in life, you know? You don't Are have to be smart you... in everything. Orana, you coming? Oh wait, also directions <sighs> to where? <laughs> God. I don't know, where do you want to go? Uh... Are you looking uh... for some interesting, unique... Artifacts sitting around, or no, maybe like artifacts. Some, uh, the destroyed civilization. You, want to go check out? you have my, you pick my interest. Eons Corporation. I know where that is. Well, where the fuck is Eons Corporation? They're a Wait. group of people that were trying to help people. Do they have like fancy hands. white buildings and? Yep. Kind of sterile. Ster yeah, sterile. Mall hosp hospital. Hospitals. Is that a thing yeah. in this Mall game? Hospital. I mean. Malls and hospitals are both things that exist. Mall hospitals don't exist anyway. <laughs> no, I know. But in this in this campaign, do hospital like exists? Uh, or is so it, just like, medieval? just to know. So for you guys, no. Like there's infirmaries. Like you can go to like 
places like that, like apothecaries and stuff. Yeah, like, like a that. doctor, a um, doctor's office. For anyone that has existed in the real world, yeah, there's hospitals and malls and everything because they're modern day end of universe <laughs> civilization. But yeah, no, you guys would have no fucking idea what a hospital or a mall is. Yeah, but I'm, I'm saying mall hospital because that was how you described it previously. <laughs> yes, that is true. If you attempt to what is a mall hospital? Mall hospital. So, uh, if you describe location, goes yes, that quite sounds like them. Uh, and you call them what the eons? Eons Corporation. As in, like long time corporation. Uh, oh, I thought it was aeons, not eons. I don't know. I I I I honestly have no idea who they are. They were wiped out before I got a chance to really talk to them. Oh yeah, but that's where the the shrimp was. Oh, very interesting. That's the and cat. Part. That's the that's the main. I don't care about the shrimp. I care about the cat that's inside the shrimp. <laughs> <laughs> he knows what I mean. Though, I so. just want to crack open the shrimp and suck I out just... its insides. <laughs> I just Probably want a really, really good tiger shrimp right now. Honestly. Anyways. Um, shrimp fried so, rice. directions. Oh, right. Yes. Um, so, just keep flying past my planet uh, until you can't fly anymore. And it should be around there. That sounds quite far. That's also... Oh, what direction, though? What Past your planet is... A lot of directions. From where you came. From where you came. I know where you came from. Do you know how long it'll take to get there? No idea. I don't know how fast you fly. Well, you, you, I thought you knew where we came from. Yeah. Okay, it because took two days. You were on Galasus. Okay. Two days to get that far. That's very impressive. Also, it didn't take two days. Oh, how long did it take? It took you like... It took like half an hour. Hours. Oh, it for, took eight yeah. hours. <laughs> It took, Holy you, shit. you got the first two hours, uh, or you got the, no, it would have took four hours, sorry, because you got the first hour uh, read to you with your mind powers, and then it was an hour drive through the asteroid belt, and then it was two hours to get to the planet after that. It was, a, it was it's, fast. It's, it's been half a day. Well, that was incredible. Less than fast. half a day. I don't know. Might take you a day or two. Okay, that's not too far. Not bad. Uh, trust me, it's far. You're just very fast. Yeah, we got a very fast ship. We got a very demonic but very fast ship. I wonder what happens if it runs out of fuel. Yeah, it solves, I don't know. We kill more people. But if it's at the edge of the universe, is there any people there? There's us. There's people on on the ship. <laughs> Doug. Doug. Why are you laughing, Douglas? Can you stop laughing like Doug? You're scaring me. Doug is becoming evil by the second. How's that uh, spear liking you? Did you know you almost missed him, Doug? Probably. I would, it wouldn't surprise me, to be honest. Okay. Cool. Anyways, anywhere else you want to know directions for Doug? I'm glad I have a plus 14 attack modifier with the weapon, which is nice. Means a bit better chance of hitting. Anyone ah, else sorry. want to know anywhere? While we're asking for directions. <sighs> so where's your dead girlfriend's body? No, so dead. Oh my That's god. Not... She's yeah. dead. I'm pretty sure Woof. she's alive, actually. Oh. Actually? Yeah, pretty sure. Where is she? She was locked away by that. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. true. Idiot. Yeah. I don't know where That's she why. is. That's why. I haven't kept in contact with her. I'm rather bored of her, to be honest. Damn. You got yourself, don't worry. Alas. Um... <laughs> So what do you just assume that I'm into guys because I dress like this? Because that's an incredibly like <laughs> fucked way of thinking. No, I just assume you're into guys because this place seems really lonely. I'm only into women. I'm straight. I just feel like you're but... effeminate enough that it would still like tick enough of the boxes. What Damn, is wrong assumptions. With you? Assumptions here. I'm, I'm... <laughs> and I think you're an uptight bitch based on your personal <laughs> appearance. Is that correct? Yes. Am I correct? Excellent. Get the fuck out of my house. 
You're probably uh, getting some my sexuality. So we're not fighting this man? Is that what we're... Is that what I don't we're know. Sounds so I disappointed. Not fighting. This is, this is so Everyone. sad. <laughs> Alexa, so play Despacito. So play disappointed Despacito. that you can't fight Charade. This is like the second time we come to him asking for a fight, and he says, nuh uh. Well, we're we'll close enough. Away. He's not going to pull it a second time, probably. You could just attack him now if you want. Yeah. <sighs> Charade, tell me why we can't. Ju why do we just not fight you here and now? Because why? I'd probably kill at least two of you before you'd win. That's not what I'm asking. I'm asking it, why. Yes, it is. You asked why should you not just fight Why me? should we let you live? I don't know, because I'm a nice guy. That's not true. <laughs> you and I both know that. <laughs> you might think that, but I know what I am. It's a matter of perspective. Yes, and I have two of them, and you have one. <laughs> no, I think Charade is nice enough. He points at his clone. Tell my to tell that to my sister, anyways. Oh Val Val does think Charade is nice enough. To live. Y yeah, to just not think about it anymore. Okay. I guess sometimes we just gotta look at a problem and say, "Not our problem." <laughs> Basically. <laughs> Alright, Trade. We know where you live. Goodbye. <laughs> we know one of the places I live in, sure. We know but... two of the places you live in. Where's the second one? The one we visited last. Oh, I thought you were gonna say the bear corpse. Mm, that too. True. I don't live in the... Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> the weird eyeball jar. I guess the question is, how did you end up in that bear corpse anyways? The weird, the weird jar in... I don't know. I think it's it in just, Val's inventory. Uh, I I was just uh, you know kind of existing, and then I guess I hit a bit of an error while I was trying to code something, and then it got very fucky. And then you got in a bear. Yeah. You're into bears. All right, let's go. No, I've never played Baldur's Gate three. <laughs> Whoa. They made Wait two of them. Two more of them. Yeah. Baldur's Gate in this Sorry. world. That was because <laughs> yeah. somebody said you're into bears. That's the yeah. only reason. I yeah, I know. <laughs> <laughs> what kind like, of bear? Cares, like, Baldur's, no, no, no. Gate. Baldur's Gate exists in the other world. We know this, but not this one. Okay, okay. Well, anyway, did anyone need a hug goodbye? Or... No, no, we're good. No. Should probably get some furniture. It's kind of empty. This is my thinking. Uh, whatever, I don't care. Just you leave. could think in a good chair. It doesn't take away from the experience of thinking. The, the homie can teleport wherever he wants. You think he really cares? He can teleport a chair into his vicinity as well. It's true. He can make chairs. You think he really cares? <laughs> we're, we're arguing about this as we're going back to the show. <laughs> All right, leave it the man on this nice planet. It you all. No, it wasn't. You know that's not true. There are no <laughs> stupid questions. Only stupid people that don't ask questions. God damn it. <sighs> Just sitting so, here wanting so a coffee. Taxing. He's as, so taxing. He's so taxing. As, like, Haru is probably the last one to leave because he's the furthest away. He just, like, looks at you and goes, So, like, this is the sun stuff now. That's kind of cool. Just decided to use something different. Fair enough. Works, hair a, lot, works a lot better at helping people. N new hair job. Yeah. Hair new job hair job. Helping people is always quite fun, isn't it? Usually. Didn't give me the sovereign glue. <laughs> Val was just like. Val Dude, is so materialistic. It's insane. Like, sovereign clue, piece of shit. God forbid somebody that likes her doesn't immediately give her a gift. Um, like, I just oh. think it would be really funny Can to you like. Believe that those ones just assume that I'm into men because I look like this. Isn't that <laughs> ridiculous? I was gonna say. Dog never assumed. Also, yes, I can. They seem to do it. It wasn't time. dog. Anyway, I was just fucking with them. You're probably the only good-looking guy, though, so, you know, swing by sometime. Maybe when you save the world. 
<laughs> smooch, smooch. No. You haven't killed anyone since then. Oh, or dropped it off anyone's I... hand. Sounds good. Okay. Um. Bye. Can Charade put Ma Mabu's hand back? To be good. No. Did you ask? No. No, wait. This, this, is Val still standing at the door? <laughs> <laughs> Can you can you put Mabu's hand back? I think that the punishment befits the crime. Didn't I didn't do anything. So why didn't you cut off some You, know, you should have cut off Doug's hand. I cut off one of his six hands. Well, he didn't do anything. So can you cut off one of my hands instead? Okay, fine. Come over here and I'll take one and, of your hands. And put I mean, don't put my hand back on his, but No, of his. course not. Yeah, sure. Right. Okay, right or left, dominant hand. Yeah, okay, it will be uh, dominant. I'll still say, well, you know what? I don't know whether Haru's right left-handed. I'm going to roll a D2. Oh, my God. D6. D2, one, he's left-handed, or one, he's right-handed, two, he's left-handed. That, that's, that's a six. A six. <laughs> D6. No, it's, it's still one. not. It's a D2. Oh. D2. I don't know. I kind of hate how fantasy... It just doesn't flip a coin, coin guys. It yeah, it rolls a d6, and its odds are evens, one or two. That's yeah. literally how it works. So anyways, <laughs> he's right-handed, so left. Okay, sounds good. Pulls out his knife. Goes to cut your arm off. Well, your hand. <laughs> cut, you sure? You sure? Off. You're okay? Do it. Yeah? We did it, not him. Slice. Can you, can you so put... you are now missing your left hand. And then he snaps... And Mabu appears, and he's in the middle of still being treated for his missing hand, and he's now panicking because he's here. He's and then Charade just puts his hand back on with another snap, and then Mabu's like, oh, okay. Um, you probably lock that hand. Out. And then Charade snaps him back. Like, okay, all done. Remember to wash that hand. Um, so, Noah... Yeah. There are some penalties for doing this. I assume I can't but do there's anything that requires two hands. Also an inspiration for this. So oh, I was about to say, do you want me to fix your hand? <laughs> you have an inspiration. Uh, I mean, it's up to Haru. If yeah, I'm asking Haru. Haru, do you want me to fix your hand after this? Well, I'd see what the... Well, okay, out of character, just let me know what the penalties are first, but... So, the penalties probably. are... You can still use two-handed things. Because you do have more than two hands. But you don't have a dominant left hand anymore. You only have bad left hand. Bad left hand. So when attempting to use both your hands, you're going to suffer negative two to any check. So if you're trying to use two-handed weapon, it's going to be a negative two. If you're trying to like steer something with both hands, negative two, etc. Right? If you need to yeah. use both your hands, it'll be a negative two. Also... Your maximum lift drag capacity and everything is going to be reduced by a quarter because you don't have a dominant left arm to use anymore. So you're kind of fucked. You're not as strong as you used to be. Uh, and finally, you're going to look funny. <laughs> Wait, tries to wave. <laughs> but those will be your punishments. Har Har, just use one of your other hands to wave. Har, you've yeah, got several. I can't just, remember just, that. Just, Hard, do several. you want me to put it back? You've got but several. <laughs> I'll stick without it for the rest of the day, but then you can put it back after. I appreciate that. <laughs> try it out. I try, try, take it for a spin. Gosh, I don't think I've ever been in a relationship with someone so sweet. Mm. What? They're both very nice. Yes, it appears that way. Anyway, goodbye. Um, I'm going to throw your hand out, unless you want to keep it, I guess. It doesn't want... make the spell to, like, do it any easier. No. No, it, it doesn't. Yeah, so, yeah, just toss it. You okay. didn't you just... promise to actually throw it out, though, because otherwise, like, it's really <laughs> weird. He just, like, literally tosses it into the garden. Okay. Garden. Yeah, least it'll be Na nature versus <laughs> nurture, I guess. Nature um, versus him using his hand for something sketchy. <laughs> or rude. Yeah. You know, Charade is a very 
upstanding and refined individual. You like understand that, right? He's just a clown. <laughs> yeah, not a clown. He's just stop him from doing something weird with the hand. <laughs> he's not a clown. He's a jester. You come back and it's like framed. <laughs> Uh, like you know, like how you like frame butterflies with the pins. Yeah. <laughs> Framed on a weird necklace. You just at the front door, flipping you off. <laughs> you know. Val Val will stop heart is bleeding. <laughs> Thanks. Oh yeah, I guess take like twenty points of damage. <laughs> Ow. More like. 20 d20, right? Here, you know oh, what? Wait. Fuck it. I'm just gonna do a full damage attack from Charade on you. Get a little hint. So, the dagger does itself... 80 damage. I am curious to how much she does. The dagger itself does 12, and then because it's essentially sneak attack, here's his death strike. Quick one. Yeah, that's reasonable. So, 34 damage. Who knows, maybe we'll all fight again someday, you know, for real. And I won't hold a hostage then, unless, you know, it's, it's needed. Unless it's convenient. It's needed. <laughs> unless I'm losing. <laughs> <laughs> unless it's convenient for the plot. <laughs> it's not even that him holding a hostage is convenient for a plot, it's just what he would do. Yeah, I mean, it makes sense. <laughs> It's like, the easiest I... way to just stop a fight. The thing is, he, of course he would do it. He already did it like 30 minutes ago. <laughs> yeah. Kind of. Okay, welcome back to the show. Uh, I'll say not his whole uh, deal, but... Doug will see that you are missing an an arm. Hand. A hand? A hand. Arm. Hand, mm -hmm. I guess. And so, he's gonna say... I got more than you. What the hell happened? It was a bit of a trade. He wanted to feel alive. You traded your hand for whose? Mabu's? Yeah. Why the hell didn't you just ask me to do it? I was the one who rushed in. Because I have more. <laughs> I have extras. <laughs> <laughs> Is he wrong? Is he wrong, though? Stop No, but him. now I feel bad. <laughs> it happened because of me. Well, to be fair, Look, I'm saying I'm sorry. I was pushing you. Yeah, it's fine, dude. They grow back. They, go, they <laughs> grow back. <laughs> right, Val? <laughs> right? Right? Sure. <laughs> and then he also looks at Val and says, uh, I'm sorry as well about Mabu. Oh, it's okay. I didn't know he was going to bring him into the fight. And didn't know if it was real or not. No, that's that. Yeah, it's fine. Honestly, nobody thought nobody thought he would just do that. We know yeah, that he's an illusionist. Bad, so. I thought maybe it wasn't real. That's why. That's yeah. That's why I said the call ball to check if he's actually there. No, it, it yeah. was actually him. It was actually him. Real Mabu IRL. Yep. The call ball was an illusion. Unless the call ball was an illusion. He's a powerful illusionist. Uh, I'm not going to think about it too hard. I don't even think he's a powerful illusionist. I think he just likes to play a lot of tricks on people. Yeah, like a fake cobalt. He didn't give me the glue. Yeah, it must be really rough being literally Val. <laughs> <laughs> to be fair, Val doesn't even care about it. I just want it. Real Isabel Val wants it. <laughs> I just want an opportunity to use Sovereign's glue on something really dumb. Stick somebody's mouth shut? <laughs> no, I was gonna like... I've given you all of their names, by the way. Who? The screen. Oh, all of them. They're all named here. Oh, yeah. Darmer, Hatsep Shut. Hatsep Shut. Hatsep Shut. Dozer? Jose? Dozer. Dozer? I think it's actually just pronounced Dozer. Dozer? It doesn't matter. <laughs> Anyways, Val feels like she owes Haru now. Yeah, we'll go back. We'll go back eventually, don't worry. Here's, uh, no, 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 there's the out of character. Besides, 30 HP for me is a lot less than it is for Mabu. Probably. 38 what? 
30 HP. <laughs> oh, I don't actually know how much Mabu has. I thought he was an HP sponge. Yeah, Mabu's got a pretty bricky HP. Like, it's because all of his spells cost him HP. I think he probably has less than Haru at this point, though. Oh, fair enough. I mean, Haru Haru's also... 164 HP. Jesus, fuck. I took tough. Oh, yeah. Um... Anyways. Uh... Do you, do you want me to grow that back for you? Yeah, yeah, let's get that going as we uh, travel. Yeah, okay. Um, it's an action. It grows like back. Also, <laughs> well, like you get all your HP back. Uh, I don't actually think it does that. No, I think it's, it's, <clears throat> it's not right, 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 because it's not actually regeneration. No, it's anyway, one of the others. Anyway, if you lose your inspiration, Val, I I'm tempted to take the inspiration away. No, but the thing is, he still did uh, it, right? Yeah, but he didn't but live with no the repercussions. Yeah. He didn't live with the repercussions. I mean, if that I'll... was a condition of what Charade did, I would have, like... If Charade knew Val could grow back or mentioned it, I'd absolutely stick with it. But he didn't not have any inspiration. He didn't say I'll, anything. I'll let you choose whether you want to keep the inspiration or not. It's your choice. No, I think it'd be fine to ditch it. Because I was like, yeah, I didn't. I did a thing, but I did not get necessarily. Uh, Should have tried to roll a die before you got it to revive. Anyway. Oh, shit. <laughs> so you guys start flying, and you're going to head off to the Aeon's Corp location that uh, Charade gave you? Most likely. Sure. Yes. Cool. Who's flying? Val and uh, Nami? The two people with a low wisdom check? Sure, go ahead. And oh, yeah! Double check. Yeah, right. <laughs> Do you want I keep somebody else to so try flying the plane? It ain't, it ain't gonna be Doug, I can't tell you that. Mom! Yeah, I was gonna say, I don't Mom. want to Mom. Mom, Mom, you drive the car. Uh... Mom, drive the car. Survival? It a survival check, in. Yeah. Turns into a station wagon as soon as uh, Rama gets on there. There's a part of <laughs> me that up. wants Val Shut to do it. <laughs> fucking station wagon. <laughs> <laughs> Just so that she can get a nat 20 and do the... And get... true. <laughs> no, no, that's specifically for the dex check. Okay. Because okay. the, the survival check is not actually about piloting the ship, it's about navigating space. Fair enough. Um, which, oh, I guess I should have probably gave Iran an advantage on that. Oh well, it's fine. <laughs> um, it's fine. 24 is totally good. You're gonna make good You just You just gotta remember the advantage when it's, when it's, when it's a bad roll. <laughs> yeah, so the first day flies nice and good. And uh, you guys happily nap. Um, and I believe probably the most efficient way for you guys to nap is to alternate, uh, like, basically watches for flying the ship. It doesn't take any skill to, like, fly the ship just to Auto keep it on course, right? Oh, well, I mean, Doug could just do it then. Doug can't. Oh, can't well, he well, still can't be Doug. doing anything during his rest. Oh, fair enough. Well, I, then I Doug and watching. Val can just take turns. Yeah, I could be watching. But oh, wait, no, I yeah. Move, uh... I guess I still only need four hours or something. Yeah, yeah, so then Doug and Val can just take turns. Sure. Um, and then, on the next day, I'm assuming you guys will have an Awoken Arana uh, do the thingamajigger? Exactly. Yeah, it's the landing. thingamabob. Mm -hmm. The... Uh, uh, make one more survival check for the next day. Aye, aye, Captain. Can you can you do a thing for me quick? Um, before I forget again, can you put immune to poison on Val? Mm, not That's easily. Uh, okay. Don't worry about it then. Yes, I need to do my port and dice. Ah, uh, yes, port and dice. I'm They're losing my important. nineteen now. Right. <laughs> Eight and fourteen. Okay, so ten is just enough to keep the course that you have achieved yesterday. So you're good. You don't Oof. have to take any longer. Any more. However, <coughs> at about noon, the strain dozer will come into the command and he'll be like, "So, do you not know how to use your radar?" Oh, we forgot. Okay, there's. Contact, big one. 
Let's go take a look. Like we're gonna... another one of you? <sighs> no, we're gonna hit it in about an hour. Doing a look. Look. Look into an hour into the future. <sighs> you really want me? You're fine. You don't oh, have to. We can that. just use the radar. <laughs> Uh, the, radar, okay. the radar will show you that there is a large object over there with many smaller objects kind of floating around near it. Uh, uh, and it is coming this direction. Oh no, is it? I hope it's not. Do you know what Sada. that is? I hope not. Um, our IFF indicates that it's a parasite ship. Oh, parasite wow. ship? I didn't know those things could navigate. We saw a parasite ship. No, but we saw a parasite ship, but it was just a big coffin. Yeah, but how did they end up there? I thought it was just like jettisoned into space. Slung. It's a ship. It has technology in it. Their Throne. invasion ships don't navigate. They are just launched like a giant a pod. missile. Like how we uh, were launched is... from the dwarves. This is not an invasion. That out ship. like a turd. Okay. Also, I. Uh, before you said anything, I knew this was going to happen, so I was going to choose probably um, the halberd. The halberd, sure. Yeah, so that it... And for the bird? And for the bird, probably also the aura of peace. Sounds good. Because... <sighs> An extra turn might be nice. An extra turn of no one attacking each other might be nice. Okay, so... We're going to have to fight it, most likely. Um, how familiar with the space combat? Uh, we we told you that we're really new to space, right? It's, we've been in space for three days, or, or the, like less than two days, and this is A it. A total of less than three days. Yes, this, this is it. This is, this is all of the experience. Are you our tutorial person? <laughs> Should we try shooting the cannons to see how they work? Does freedom of movement work in space? Okay, so I'm going to make it very simple. You need to keep your engine going, and you need to make sure they don't destroy it. That's all you need to know. Okay. Parasite ships aren't equipped with capital class weaponry, so there isn't going to be anything massive hitting your ship, but there's going to be an invasion fleet. Probably a lot of them. Are you guys going to help? <laughs> we are <laughs> on the ship with you. Okay, lovely. Yes. Survival kind of conveys. I'll just watch from my spaceship and chill. I'll just watch from my spaceship and chill. Yeah, yeah. yeah we'll it's very uh, possible there. that a lot of us will die if it is a fully functional parasite ship. Because it is going to be filled to the teeth with parasites. Are they at least something you can eat? You know, I'm not sure we've tried really we can't eat the corpses they inhabit because no, they're no. dead but we haven't tried slurping back a parasite yet it seems like a bad idea i think if you kill it first it wouldn't problem i i don't know <clears throat> anyway uh get prepared i suppose Okay, and, so uh, at this point, I will ask that you all choose to move to where you want to be for combat to start. Yeah. So who wants guns? Who wants reloading? Who wants maintenance? I feel like Nami needs maintenance. Like maintenance. Yeah. Downstairs. Yeah. Like, I feel I feel like Nami would be best doing that because Nami is the most proficient at that. Yeah, I would have picked it out as well. So oh. I have some idea. That's true, but I, I, I think Dub could also do it if, if in a he, pinch, yeah. Yeah. He does also have Tinker's tools, which he's proficient in. Can we have some of the screen man guns too? Uh, they cannot man the magical weaponry. Can, can oh yeah. Uh, become biped, fetal, and. Just no. start. <laughs> no. okay. It's not a machine gun; it's a cannon. Okay, well, reminds everyone: thing. if bark, you bark, are right planning right on, right. if you are planning on using the cannons at some point, it is in the parcel. If you go to the right, 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 right. There, they are there. I do have. Make it. sure yep. you, you grab <clears> one. And one. Sure. Remember that you can use 
You can use Dex. What were those stats? It was everything. You, can... you cannot use Con or Wisdom. <coughs> okay. Pretty no. much strength, Dex. It's it's demonic, so charisma is fine. It it should be everything except for Constitution and Wisdom. Sounds good. Okay. So you can choose. Just make sure you edit it when you add it. Every. Is everyone in position? Is that okay? I don't know. Is everyone in position? Is this fine? I have to assume someone needs to stay in the chair. Someone needs to run repairs, and reloading is also downstairs? No, reloading is. They reload automatically after three rounds if or... you don't do it. Or it's these pentagrams in the command room. Okay. I think Val can run around in here and do that. Maybe. Yeah, I'm really slow because I have less movement than you guys and something that makes me stay still. Does, does Can Marissa mm, reload? No. no. Okay. But can I shoot a gun on top of Marissa? No. You'd be too yep. high up. The but, controls okay, are that, on that's okay, though. That's okay, too, because I can just get on Marissa. Yeah. Uh, easy and then get on. So get I'm just going to have her on. near me. Sounds good. Uh, I think I have... Can, can a... What's it called? Servant. Do it. An invisible servant? Yeah. I, I think I have that spell. I might not have it anymore. Oh, wait. I have Summon Greater Demon. We could... <laughs> Oh yeah, that that would probably go great. Look, I just summon a friendly I think one. Me and Haru are okay manning the two sides, right? There's only two sides to this ship, and there's yep. the front. There's no and the front gun. In the, back. the front gun is actually fired from the seat, and it can't move. It only shoots yeah. straight. Yeah. So Val, you can shoot the front cannon, and I can shoot the right cannons, and Haru can shoot the left cannons in case. Uh, like well. No, but the and thing is, you fine. still need someone in this room to reload and steer Haru. the ship. Sorry, not Haru. Arana. Arana. And you should be the one steering the ship, right? Unless it could be Arana. Or it could be Arana, and then well, you could, you could yeah, use uh -oh. the four. I have it written down what the four things do. Awesome, okay. Four command panels can reload the guns, check for damage, adjust flight patterns. Like, a small flight pattern. Um and thrown for flying the ship engine room has an engine restart and fixing it requires two people for that oh it and requires two people for that it, requires long uh, distance. it does not require two people oh, it requires yeah, never heard. two actions uh, it requires oh. a fix of the engine two and a restart actions. from the panel okay anybody with a half or armor could do that by themselves in one turn because yeah, they have the burn the, the half or armor's <laughs> biggest effect yeah yeah. Or the the dog, the dog, the dog can action surge. Dog, dog, dog could actually action surge, yes. So as a note, you have an hour before they show up. It's a new day. You do not have bubbles. Oh yeah, bubbles, please. All right, I'll do that then. Okay. So we I will like burn bubbles. Ah, uh, I can't breathe. Ah, uh, wait, no, I can't. I don't need to. You can breathe oh. while you're on the ship. It's just if they destroy the. Need to breathe. Yeah. If you just if they destroy the uh, life support, you guys can't breathe yeah. anymore. Yeah. It's just a just in case. Yeah. Can has can hats puthets hats hat set hat hat set should can breathe without anything. They have armor. They are all wearing strain armor, which has helmets that can breathe. Which has helmets. Face. Sounds good. Oh hey, so if they die, we can take their helmets, right? No, if they die, they explode. They explode. God, fuck, right. They, if they die, they damage Don't the ship. Don't stay near them when they explode. Yeah. Okay. Near the ship's so, uh, you guys I'm are dead. all ready at positions? I still and haven't then... decided. <laughs> oh, you still haven't decided? Okay, fair enough. If you need to go to the other page, let me know. I guess they're probably going to board us, honestly. Probably. So we have the people on deck say, are uh, the frontliners. Oh, so it wouldn't be bad to have another person, like, ready, Wait. though, to take over guns. Mark. True. Yes? If she were to cast uh, Wall of Force, would the Wall of Force stay put and, like, yeah. destroy whatever's... <laughs> like, while the ship is moving, it just, like, pushes people back? 
So you can also so cast a wall of force in front of the ship as it flies. Note, um, a capital class ship, like the big one that you guys are in, would collapse a wall of force. That makes sense. From sheer power. I understand that's not how the spell works, but it would collapse the sphere if you put it in front of a capital class ship. For the smaller ones, like the hover tank here, um, yes. it wouldn't get destroyed by the impact because they move in relation to things around them. No, that's what and I'm saying. I meant more like if we put it on top of the ship, would, yes, would it if move you put with it, the ship? If you put it on top of the ship, the ship would immediately like disappear behind you. So it would be a way to instantly remove a ship if you were to put a oh. wall of force around it. Interesting. Okay. Because you guys are going super fast, and the wall of force is stationary. Okay. Well, so don't wall of force the engine. That would destroy the ship. Uh, no. If it, sorry, if you want to place a wall of force on the ship, that's fine yeah. because it's okay. rooted to a capital class ship. I thought you were speaking more of like smaller ships, like how the hover tank is no, floating fair. around the yeah. thing. Um, that's if you fine. want to collapse a sphere around a small ship, it will just disappear in the distance. If you want to place one on the capital class ship, that's good. It'll stay there. It'll be fine. Okay. Because you could potentially shut the uh, engine from being attacked by putting a wall of force around it. Uh, the engine is too big because oh. the wall of force is uh, not quite True. that. Like, the engine not is that huge. big. Okay, um, yeah. You could put it around something like the oxygen system because it's it's only two by two in the basement. Uh, stuff like that. But, uh, blocks the entrance. You could, That's what you I was thinking. Maybe the back entrance. Yeah. Entrance. But uh, just know there are a lot of entrances all over the ship. Yeah. Do you we want me to look eyes. at the basement again, Cube? We need yeah, eyes sure. on the basement, I think. I like, can be the one in the basement. In case shit goes down. Oh, this, is the the, uh, this is the entrance here. And then you come around here. Very claustrophobic. Uh, uh, and then there's a door here which you can open and then this is where it gets funky because this is this is like a bow so this is an entrance all along here these are all entrances oh, they can just get from here yeah they can they on can the just sides, go under yeah. the ship and then come in from the side here uh and then this room only has the two doors uh this room has three entrances so you can see there's two on the right and one on the left and then the back door which uh oh, Dharma is standing by so there's no way to like just block these off with a single wall of force. But like I said, you could if you wanted to. This uh, oxygen room here, that's just a two by two square. So you could wall of force that. I don't see a reason to because we have the bubbles and the uh, they can survive yeah. the other guys. So it's yeah, not just needed. let me know. Oh, yeah, I can stay down here. I yeah, so feel free it. to move around down there. Just the doors auto close once you walk by them. So make sure you close any door that you Are you, you able to send messages there, Nami? Yeah. yeah. Nami can send message, yeah. I have message. But I, I think just, that's... I mean, any, any, like, oh, tell us there's a problem. But we can also check for problems uh, at the top, right? With the yeah. four panels. If there's a problem down here and I see it, I'll know. <laughs> yeah, yes. but we won't. Unless, unless you tell us there is. We'll handle it. We'll okay. see how it goes. So, everyone is ready? Yeah. Yep. Cool. Radio so, the large Arby. ship comes into view about 15 minutes from uh, the hour mark that you were told. So, like, you've got, you've got about 15 minutes while you can see it, uh, but it's obviously still quite far away. Uh, but before it gets kind of even closer, small ships do appear. So I'll have everyone roll initiative. In fact, I think I'm going to just click a button here. Uh, yeah, I'm just going to roll initiative for everyone. Uh, because I had to roll initiative for the screen again. And then... Got the... Good luck, Nami. Thanks, you too. <clears throat> Good luck with that sickness, too. Thanks. Down with the sickness? Uh, Please. Wow. 
So these ships zoom in rather quickly. One here, one here. These small skimmers are quite small and thin ships. Uh, and then these drop ships are a bit bulkier and rounder. And uh, this one zips over and drops its load right away. Uh, but the other one is slowly coming around the left. Can I keep a door open as long as I'm next to it? Uh, yes. All right, cool. So the drop out of this one is uh, Swarm 1, Swarm 2. Oh, jeez. And the Abomination. So like Josh. we know a lot of we know a lot of parasites, but they're like they're usually not good, right? But we just know a lot of good ones. Um, it's definitely a quantity uh, over quality thing. There's just so many actual parasites that you guys haven't met. Uh, like just to give you an example, these are these swarms are like thirty green parasites each. Like this, this is already sixty. Which no, is no, I know, but we've met, met, we've yeah. met a bunch of, yes. well, a bunch. We've met a like a handful of them that are nice, but that yes. doesn't mean all of them are nice. No, they're generally extremely not yeah, nice. Yeah, so we've had problems with them in the past more often. So, yeah. uh, the swarms are just large swarms of the uh, parasites in different creatures, uh, and then this abomination is like one that has grown and is bloated, and like tendrils are like seeping out of its rotten flesh. <laughs> And it Sheesh. is not very comfortable looking. Uh, and it has, yeah, one big eye that kind of like is on the upper part of its Wait abdomen. It is very uncomfortable. Uh, and let's go, Haru. It is your turn. Nice. So, for the cannons, just an action yep. of fire and then their reload, right? Yep. And they've yeah. got like, they've got a 90 degree cone. So it would be like this and also this at like the same time. I'm at the complete bottom. Nice. So I could or so low. What like the? You could shoot yeah, either could skimmer do... or even the dropship. Yeah, okay. All of those go for the dropship. Sure. As action, so boom, boom. Well, bye, bye fuck me. <laughs> that is an unfortunate dropship. I really, I can't wait to see how many fucking. No. I have a lamb kablooey. So yeah, you you <laughs> fire the cannon. By 61 instant death. <laughs> you fire oh, the cannon and the shot just goes straight through the very small cockpit and the whole thing just explodes. Jesus. Instantly. Rest gone. rest in piss fucking weird space bugs. Piss and peace. Now delete all the other enemies that would have <laughs> appeared on this map. That's good. That's Which great. one is the reload circle? All uh, of them. They all, all do four. it. All four okay. do reload. <clears throat> uh, I know you didn't see anything get deleted, but a lot of stuff got deleted. Okay, I believe. I'm going to use my two <coughs> points. Sure. To bonus action moonbeam right on the center of like the swarm of parasites and the parasitic abomination. Right, because it's a five foot... Wait, yeah. how big is it? It's five, so actually I guess I could only hit two. I couldn't have both swarms because it's five feet. Yeah, because it would be. It'd be. It's basically a four squares, and I can hit the abomination and the swarm parasite. No, it's it's uh, this, right? I guess yeah. So you would have to put it like here. Yeah. Okay. That's those are big swarms, Jesus. Yes, they are. Uh, huge swarms of medium aberration or gargantuan well, swarms of or medium aberration. It's five foot radius. Cylinder. So, yeah. Oh, five foot radius cylinder? Yeah, I just double checked, yeah. Yowie, zowie. Okay, if it's a five foot radius cylinder, that means we are good to go uh, 10. Because that's diameter. No, that's radius. Oh, you're right, that is radius. The other one, the other one, yeah, that's, that's, so yeah, that's for how that square, looks. Yeah. It does side length, for circle, okay. it does radius. So yeah, I can like, like get those two. Yeah, basically, sort of yeah. prevent them from moving across that center too easily and hit two of them right at the start. Uh, boom, boom. Uh, oh, okay, so boom. Oh, am I, am I targeting that swarm? It doesn't show up as a thing, but that could be because it's literally on me. Oh, abomination. 
There you go. Oh, okay. you had it. There you go. You it had does it. show up. It just doesn't show yeah. an arrow at all, which kind of makes sense. <laughs> okay, so adding that to myself, making the saves. Okay, lost my hat. Four damage on each. Let's go. Big spellcaster coming Huge through. Huge damage. There goes all my fast spells for the day. Cool. Now that's a lot of damage. I mean, I did Dude's a list. first attack, so instant death is good. Yep. How, so what's the cone of this side? Uh, uh, it's like a 90 degree. It's 90, 90 degrees. So you, you can definitely it's hit about a like, skimmer here. It's like this, right? Yeah. yeah. There's literally a, a cone thing, right? There is so a cone, eh? <laughs> it, it would be like this, though. So it would be uh, like this, and then also the same cone beneath it, too. Okay. Sounds good. So, yeah, I, you can I, definitely I... hit anything here. Okay. Gonna probably shoot at the skimmer. Which one? Skimmer one or skimmer one. two? I'll shoot one. Sure. Uh, with the sky ship cannon and using strength, which will miss. Ah, oh, fantastic. The shot just like ripples through the air and passes by the skimmer as it kind of like zips. Oh, around. Uh, pretty quick. Me and Haru, me and Haru is such dynamic duo of duality. <laughs> dynamic dynamic duo, duo of, of duality. duality. <laughs> That is my Through her words were never worded no. by a word word words words man. Uh so yeah, I I So you have made missed. one attack with your attack action. Wait, can I shoot multiple times? It's not loaded. Oh shit. But you can move away and make two melee attacks if you want. That's true. That's true. Wait, is this thing on the ship? Yeah. I... Yep. Yep. The only one that's not is the dropship. The dropship is hovering about 30 feet above it. Well, shit. And then uh, I will attack with the Soul of Tear. No, no, no. The, the Soul of... Why do I call it Dog's Halberd? It should be Soul of... Alas. Um, soul of Zolotl is a different item in your inventory. That's true. It's my armor, it's the armor. I guess. Okay. Uh, I will attack him with the sure. Halberd. Pretty sure there's no reactions on this guy. Yeah, no. He's just annoying as hell. Actually, I feel like I should use... Oh, yeah. I... Why not? I'll try the... I'll try the pike. Why not? Is that fine? Uh, yeah, go for it. Yeah, I use the pike instead. It hits. I feel like it'll do less damage if he's the peace one. Uh, it does do less damage. It does less bit, damage, but just it does by a little bit. Well. But it does radiant, yeah. Hmm. <clears throat> it's pretty much the same as me rolling a 9 and a 4. Like on 2d10s, right? Mm. Uh, but yeah, that's the first attack. Yeah, and you got uh, one more. I got one more. I don't know if that'll hit. Oh, it does. Okay. It's a big fleshy target that doesn't have a lot of armor. Just a lot of HP. Oh. That's okay. That is a pretty good damage roll. <laughs> it's fine. I still have a plus nine to hit uh, to all damage. <laughs> Excellent. Uh that is it. Uh for my turn. I guess. Yeah, that's it. Ah, ah, ah. So, Ronald, ah, you are ah, 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 you're ah. in the belly of the beast. Well, no. You're just surrounded by a huge swarm of parasites that are going to try and claw and beat you to death. Why don't they try to get in? <clears throat> because like, they're not it... just the parasites. They're parasites in creatures. Oh, uh, okay. Don't worry, Isabel. They can get in, but only I if you're a corpse. Gust of... Are they small enough that if I gust of... They are medium food? creatures. Fuck it. Donut, okay. <laughs> they are a gargantuan swarm of medium creatures. That's kind of scary. Uh, it is, huh? It's like a flesh man. Imagine it's if the other drops have dropped their stuff off, too. Thunder wave pointing towards the other swarm. 
Yeah, sure. So Thunder Wave all all of them. Um, I don't. Does Thunder, Just so I'm not pointing does... up at Haru. Yeah, yeah, yeah I got no. you. So you're gonna hit the Swarm of Parasites you're in, the Abomination, and the Swarm of Parasites too. Um, yeah. And I don't think it can knock back swarms. Uh, I mean, it says unsecured objects are, that are completely within the area. Uh, you're objective fine. It does just say creature. I'm gonna just look up this thunder wave push thing. I don't see why not. Well, Por what it... if you only hit half the swarm? It doesn't make any sense. Well, then I think oh, that's just DM's discretion. And you push half of them back. Make two mini swarms. <laughs> I'm not. I don't have the mechanics for that. How far does thunder wave push it back? <laughs> Ten feet. You just push it half the you distance. Just say the ones that like you move the whole thing back ten feet and say the ones that were closer are still that closer edge. Because the swarms are fifteen or twenty feet across. Yeah. Hmm. So uh this is an interesting example. This guy's saying, Can you use Thorn Whip to bring oh my a, God, swarm a swarm of piranhas on shore onto a shore? <laughs> Um, Can you use Thorn Whip to fish piranhas? <laughs> the thing is, swarms are immune to being grappled. So yeah. in the case of <clears throat> Thorn Whip, I can see why you would rule that it doesn't work. I will say, and this will be for future reference as well, if you use this ability, this Thunder, thunder Wave, to push a swarm, you must encompass the whole swarm to push it. Oh, that's Is fair. that fair? <clears throat> yeah, okay, cool. that's fair. So you're not pushing the swarms, but you will push the abomination. Uh, actually, you won't, yeah. but that's because of where it is. Yeah. <laughs> but anyway, I am, either way, I am hitting all three of them. Yes. Regardless if they have to shuffle backwards or not. Yes. Oh, and they are difficult terrain when you're in the swarms. I sense. figured. I almost made it so you couldn't move through them, but they could move on to your square because they're medium creatures. I was almost that brutal. Okay. I. You ever try moving in a train four... packed full of people? I, I am going to cast this as a fourth level Thunder Wave. Sure. Thunder Wave, go boof. So it's 4d8. Because third level, fourth level. Yes, and it's a 2d8. So. I thought thun Wait, isn't Thunder Wave 3d8? Am I crazy? Thunder Wave's damage. No, it's... Sorry, no, it, it would be 5, because it's yeah. it's a first level spell at 2. So, second first, level, third level, fourth gotcha. level. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Gotcha, so yeah, 5. Okay. Go for it, buddy. Make them save. Make them save. Uh, Looks like one succeeded. The, the, oh, the, the, the abomination? Nice. And then the other ones both fail. <laughs> so go ahead and roll damage. It should do the halving of it. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Jump automation. Let's go. Boom. Thunder wave. 22 points of damage to those two. Nice. And Is there anything else one, for your turn? Two. Oh, this is, I'm not actually moving. I'm just... Math one, two. It'd be twenty feet. Third five. Okay. Yeah, I'd like to not be actively within the swarm anymore, please. Thank you. Sounds good. <laughs> uh, and that's all for your turn. Yes. Cool. Hatsepsha is going to use for her uh, temp HP first. Because she gets a shield. Uh, and then she's going to use her thermal blade. <coughs> There's no way she rolled a natural 20. It did. Yeah, there okay. is. It's, yeah. only a, it's a 5% chance. Destroy okay. this thing. The parasitic abomination is dead. The thing is, we rolled like <laughs> 5 not 20s this game, this session. And not a single like nat 1. Okay, so it is dead. Oh, no, no damage. Uh, if they roll a critical hit, the Man, target is reduced to zero HP. Oh God. Um. Yeah. 
Wait, that's, that's something, all yeah. creatures? That's, yeah. <laughs> well, it's any one creature. It wouldn't work on the swarms. But, uh, yes. But this is something that could work on us. Yeah. Yeah. No, absolutely. If you guys fought these, it, you'd have a rough time. It doesn't instantly kill you, mind you. It just reduces you to zero. But since it's an enemy, that yeah, yeah, functionally kills death it. Death saves, whatnot. Don't like this. Okay. So the dropship is going to go. And it leaves line of sight for you guys on deck and comes below deck. I know where it is, right? Uh, no. Why not? I'm I'm sitting That's at the not chair. Not your turn. Oh, okay. Uh, so the dropship's going to deliver troops down here. So, uh, you know what, Nami? You're down here in the basement, right? Why don't you roll me a d4? Okay. Oh no. One. Nice. One. Okay. One. One. Where where did I put the drops? Oh, you know what? It's probably under encounters. Yeah, here it is. So drop ship one. <laughs> where I don't know where it is. Honestly, I can't see it from here. It's probably over here. Or over here. Oh, that's a swarm. So they swarm in from here and from here. They're going to have to clip in the walls, but that's fine. They're a swarm. They're a swarm. They're in the walls. They're in the goddamn walls. So they just swarmed in. They swarmed in from uh, over there. Just so you know. You, just here? You see, yeah, where the arrow's pointed. That's exactly where. Yeah, I see it. I see the dropship. I was just saying, there, you said dropship one, and I was confused because it's yeah, dropship two. Yeah, no, it's two. dropship two. No, dropship one because you rolled a one on the d4. Oh. That's that's what dropship encounter you got. Swarms. Yes, two more. Uh, and now it is Marissa's turn! Uh, go ahead, uh, Daisy. Uh, it is now your turn. So at the start of your turn, uh, you can choose how you would like the ship to be flying. You can go full speed forward, which might affect some of the people on the deck. You can take evasive maneuvers, which will definitely affect people on the deck. Or you can just keep it steady. Um, I feel like they're handling the deck stuff pretty good. So I'll leave it as is. So keep it steady. Sounds good. Uh, one of the other actions you can take is to... Uh, perform a radar pull, which will tell you where everything is. Cool. Um, do I have like a status update on how loaded the guns are? Um, that is from the side panels, not the command yeah. chair. Wish you could do both. Uh, sorry, dog. Oh. I mean, you definitely heard two of them fire. Yeah, only two though. Talk to the other cannons. They're not down fired yet. Yeah. We'll do a status. Doug could have walked over. To, to oh, yeah, he 100% so. could have and shot another cannon. Anyway, uh, you want to do a radar pull? Seriously? Yeah, just to get a... So you see that there are four skimmers uh, that are looking at the main deck, and they're probably going to be shooting at the people there. And then you see the one dropship has went to the bottom left of the ship, uh, near the back. So basically directly to the left of you and up about four squares is where it is, but on the bottom. Okay. <clears throat> There's not much I can do from here, right? Not really, no. I mean, this door is open and I can see this parasite. This door shouldn't be open. No one has opened this door. Oh, I left it open. It is an automatically closing door. Oh, I see. On a spaceship. Fair enough. We're on a spaceship? <laughs> no, we're okay. on a space board. Get it right. Dozer can reload the guns. He cannot interact with magic items. He fucking can't, right. Um, okay, well... <laughs> uh, 5, 10, 15, It'll explode 20, 20, 20, 20, 30. Remember. I will stand here and wait until I hear uh, two more. To reload. Okay. You ready your action to reload when you hear two more. Okay. <clears throat> Reloading! 
So Cleo has heard all of the swarm come in here and comes over. You've left this door open, right? Cool. So she is going to fire her uh, beam rifle at the swarm and miss. Very cool. Thank you, Kanye. Uh, Dozer's going to stay here and look back at Val interacting with the Pentagon and go, huh, all right. And he readies an action to shoot at anything that comes through the door. Uh, Narmer is going to pull out his uh, spark thermal blade. He's going to go into the swarm right in front of him. It's a hit. 27 points of damage. And as somebody might have noticed, there's a vulnerability there. Vulnerable to whatever they did. Dick and probably balls. the fire. I, I was about to say it's probably fire. Probably this fire. Swarm, vulnerable to fire? That's ridiculous. This Unreal. swarm does that thing where it's a swarm. Uh, and it's going to use a flurry of claws and beaks. So enjoy your deck saves. Um, Haru saves. Arana does not. And there is a lot of slashing damage to be had. Ouch. Haru maintained concentration, though. So that's cool. Yeah, that is handy. In Haru flares. Enjoyable. Do they just not touch him? Also, I just realized the... Uh... I believe this is where you had the moon beam, right? Yeah. Yeah. When no, it's does... still their no, it's yeah, I did that wrong. It's supposed to be when they start their turn, but they already did their damage, so or they already took their damage, so it's fine. Okay. Well, one of them got insta killed, so it didn't matter. Oh, well. Yeah. It it literally didn't. And then this swarm well, is I'm going sorry, to do that. I just don't its matter. swarm thing. Ah. Uh... One, two, three, because it's gonna move here. Uh, and it's going to use its flurry of claws and beaks as well. Uh, success, success, success. Uh, Marissa shouldn't have evasion right now. Not when I'm on. Uh, uh, not with that attitude. Not with that attitude. Uh, two. Uh. I think you might be right, but... I think the evasion is oh only when you're God. on her. I totally forgot that they're immune to non-magical damage. <laughs> oh, well, that's good. I'm going to the I bathroom. Guess. I'll be back. So is Doug just the only good one luck. taking damage? <laughs> well, no, it should be Marissa, too, because she doesn't have evasion, right? That's correct, yeah. So Marissa should have took 22 as well. Okay. Okay, we'll make correct, it. I guess. Oh, actually, sorry. They should only be... They should only be immune to that while their shield is up, but I couldn't do that. So we'll have to do some funky shit if their shield is up. Some ding-dongs? Yeah. Well, if you make it a, a thing, you can click their thing and turn it off, right? So go on effects, and then you can turn off the effect by clicking it uh -huh, yeah. on and off. Yeah. If that's a thing that you can do. Do you know how you have to do abilities for creatures in no. the uh, end? No, I, I really don't. You have to type it out in specific phrases. Literally. And not it. everything is supported. No. Oh. So I can't do things not where the they get temporary. The no, it's not. It should be, but it's not. Or it should at least support both. Yeah, or support. But they both. were like, hmm, let's not do that. That would be. You weird. literally, the only way for abilities to work, Doug, is it basically to type them like they're typed in the monster manuals. That's very strange. So, like, for a creature yeah. to have regeneration, it has to be worded the exact same way as a troll. Hmm. It's annoying. And then now it's the swarms down here. The swarm's going to come over here and do its swarm thing. Uh, 
failed save from Nami, successful from Cleo. A bunch of slashing damage. And then this swarm of parasites <coughs> is going to go after Dozer, but it's not going to do anything, so I'm not going to do it. It's the hover tank's turn. Hover tank. Hover tank. So it is going to turn, and you're going to see a targeting beam line up on the Swarm of Parasites 2 from its main gun. I'm underneath that, bro. Yeah, you're going to want to move. Oh, hold on a second. <laughs> uh, and then it's going to fire... Uh-oh. It's going to fire its four pintle laser guns at uh, the skimmer next to it. I also just like have my my, my token keeps me very. That's because it's underneath. Cool. So it almost destroyed that skimmer. Okay, skimmer's turn. It is time for you guys to hate me. Hate me so much. Fine. So Doug, skim, skim. this Doug. skimmer hits you with five magic missiles. Jesus Christ, no. No, no the concentration. Uh, and that's all it does. And that's all all the skimmers do. You, should have, uh, you guys should have shields as well, could you? should just have shields. This skimmer is going to move over here, over the deck, <laughs> and it's going to fire at Haru. Five Not the magic concentration. Missiles. Wait, did I succeed? You did no. not fail a single one. No. Nice. Concentration 8 versus EC 10. Oh, I don't fail. Know. Yeah, you're right. Oh, yeah. I don't just, know why. just rolled it for all of them. It, yeah, I guess because the damage came in before any of them did its thing. The strain uh, tank takes some damage there, and the other skimmer is going to zip around and also shoot at the, the tank. Yes, I did actively give an enemy that is going to be very prevalent five magic missiles. <laughs> Best of luck. Nami, it is your turn. Holy shit, it's my turn. Do you need to right. target yourself? I don't know if you have yourself selected, but... I do now. So I got flurried to blow by just these things. Yes, you are just covered in a swarm of parasites trying to claw and rip you apart. Cool. Jelly. Fireball myself. <laughs> I mean, it hurt them more than it hurts you. Big time. I guess there's also Cleopatra. That's their name, alright? Yes, Cleo. I can probably hit the Paris. Can I potentially hit them, but not myself? I can hit the wall. Um, yes. Probably. Well, how big is the radius on Fireballs? Like 20? 20. Foot yeah. Maybe 20. A forty foot diameter bone, homie. Yeah, you could do this. <coughs> yeah, I only get swarms. Um, I will note that this could damage the engine. Oh, it no. could damage the engine. It could. There's a chance. Could. Sesper, my brother. Uh, the room down here is just a bit Hashtag too small for a fireball to uh, not risk damaging the engine. But yeah, uh, where's the other guy? There, I know there's one right here. Yeah, he's. I've targeted it, so you're not hitting it. The other screen is directly in the center of that. Uh, yeah. I was thinking that instead of doing that, just do a lightning bolt. Do lightning bolt? Sure. You can do It'll it. do damage and also heal me, so you know. Am I targeting both of them? Uh, yes, you are. Right, I can't really see because this one's yeah, on no top of me. <laughs> uh, lightning bolt. Uh, a fail and a fail. All right. Zap. Wait, Zap. Zap Brannigan. I get half, right? That's healing? Or salt? Uh, no, you get, yeah, you get half. Yeah, yeah. So you get 14. Yeah, half total. Woo. Cool. Fourteen minus one is like 
27. You were at 41. 41 yeah. minus 14 would bring you to 25. Or 27, sorry. Nice, 27. See, my math is always correct. Also, you didn't let me move, but it's fine. Sorry, <laughs> you can move if you'd like. It's difficult terrain in the parasite. Oh, cool. I can't wait to move to 10 feet. Yeah, so where would you like to move? One. Two. Cool, so that I'm is not... still in the square. You know what? I'll just stay here. Why not? I'll stay there? Okay. They are a lot faster than you. Dunn yeah, I, I guess. You see yeah, a big laser. Or, sorry, yeah, it's Haru's turn. Yeah, yeah. Haru, I will also note for you uh, the swarm of parasites that Doug is currently in is being targeted by the big main cannon on the hover thing. Yeah. Definitely not a spot I want to be uh, when it's about to shoot. I don't think. Hey, I can move within us. Well, is, do swarms get opportunity attacks? I can move uh, within them. Yes. But if I move outside of uh, range, they get mad. What's up? So, but if I get out of range, they get mad. Yeah, they'll they'll make an attack of opportunity. Okay, well, I'll just move outside of it at least and start okay. swinging at this one. Sure. Um, no, or mm. you know, what? I'll actually just fire shield myself. Sure. Since uh, fire is a thing. So and yeah, You have so not seen them be weak to fire yet, Haru. Oh, the swarm, you said. Or was that not me? I couldn't that see that. That was the bottom floor. Okay, never mind. Shut up. It's been unlogical. I mean, it unlogical. still makes sense to flare. That would probably be what I would do instead. But I would, I'm going to attack first, because if I crit, I'm going to... Uh, Shit? Might. So yes, shit. Well, hold up a second. Pretty close. He's Critteria. Critteria. Sorry, this is, should be here. Ah, so close. Yet so far. I will do the flare. Okay. The baby. Shut up. Now it's Doug's turn. I I I I It is Doug's turn, right? I yeah. That is me. Bonus action action. That stuff. Do you have your token selected or do you need this one? I may need to select the token. Yeah. Yeah, I, I will on my turn I will need you to do that too, because when I was wiggling the arrow keys around, I was moving Haru. Awesome. So Thank anyway, you, uh, yes, Doug, you do know that. that this swarm is being targeted by the cannon. That's true, huh? Um, okay, and so I'm here. So 10, 20. 25. Get on top of Marissa. Sure. Um, make it easier. Uh, and then I'm gonna attack... There are so many enemies on screen right now that start with yeah. the letter S. Yeah. <laughs> Everything is an S. Gonna attack the swarm of parasites. Go right ahead. Look it's at that. They're easy to hit. I'm gonna attack again. And then with Marissa, I'm going to move 5 20, or to 10, 20, 50, uh, whatever. Yeah, that's good. Good enough. And then I'm going to jump it out for another 5 feet, making it that's my full movement. Okay. And I will shoot as my third action if I can. You definitely oh, there's can't nothing, hit anything. Not, there's nothing not there to enough. shoot, eh? Yeah, okay. That is how it is, huh? Uh, in that case, I will continue to attack. Sure. Uh, as this last The attack. skimmer is 60 feet off the ground. Yeah, I know. Yeah. I assumed there was a, sp uh, a, sh a spaceship. It is. And it's shooting magic missiles, which is just lovely. That's a natural 20, Max. Yay. 
smile. You get the big crit. They get the big crit. Well, it doesn't do much, but... Well... Yeah, 27 you damage. 20 d10. Good. Disappointment. <laughs> yeah. Definitely not a, a 20 d10 attack, for sure. But, there you go. It's my turn. Nice. Or I Rana. guess, well, Marissa, Marissa can attack too, huh? Sure, go oh, it. bother. I'll just do a few attacks. Two yeah, really attacks. Attack, see if it right? works. Just yeah, note I... that, uh, oh no, that's never mind. Oh, wait, there. I, I found me. <laughs> I, does it take normal damage? Yeah, it, oh, it does. does. Okay. <laughs> and then the damage of the. Uh... Of the... There you go. That's <clears> turn. <throat> you know. Nice. Now we're good. Uh, is some uh, something's being targeted at the second swarm or both swarms? It's the right swarm, not both. Okay, you're, you're not in the swarm that's being targeted. Okay, so I'm gonna gooch up outside of the swarm again. Sure. And uh, where's the I'm gonna do the same thing again. Sure. Same level, same everything. Sounds good. Same level, same targets, same <laughs> fucking lather rinse repeat. Same fuckery do. Failed. Sheesh. Nice. Good damage. And that's all for your turn. Uh, I'm gonna. I'm gonna double check. Okay, I'm still good. Never mind. Yep, I'm good. Cool. So, uh, hats up, should uh, sees this thing being targeted, and she looks over at Doug. And then she says, Sorry, man. These guys in the fucking guns are lunatics. And she hops over the side here and then runs. Oh, that's... Okay. So she, she's in the basement now. The She's talking about her own screen... Uh, yeah, talking gunman. about the people manning okay. the hover tank. So Okay. I see. That's fine. Doug's not pissed off. He knows that she's... They're trying to take down the swarm, so it's just they don't really care about safety. Doug. Uh, the dropship <laughs> sneaks back up on this side, over where Haru is, uh, oh, and shit. then flies center over one? here. Yeah, this is the one that went down low, uh, and it's going to deliver troops up here. So I will let Haru roll a d4 this time. Don't roll a one. Cool. No. Seven hundred. <laughs> this One just got million so much harder. <laughs> You're welcome, everybody. Fuck. That's nice. So there's a preacher. And oh yeah, they're weird religious guys. Yes, they are extremely religious. Praise Jesus. Uh oh. This so much. Cool. Um, and that's the end of the dropship's turn. By the way, you should probably kill that. Yeah, the dropship. Yeah, yeah, probably. Yeah, the preacher. So the preacher, as soon as he lands, he's like uh, a parasite wearing. Oh, like, we should robes, kill all of it, but like. <laughs> Wearing robes, and he's got like kind of a harness over him that has like a almost like a pew thing, like set up in front of him with a book on it, and he's covered in lots of like candles and stuff. And he waves as a powerful. So he's got a lectern attached to him. Yeah, yeah, and he waves as like a powerful uh, divine wave uh, reaches out from him. Let's see, what will he choose? I'm glad I'm not out there. <clears throat> it's 
So he's going to uh he's going to use uh regenerative faith. So all of the parasites that he can see oh, are going to heal uh 20 HP. Oh god. That's not good. Yeah, I recommend uh get rid of this creature. He's gonna fuck you guys up. So that's not an action, that's just at the start of his turn. And then for his spell, he will What what spells does he have access to? Did I fuck up and not give him his full spell list? Oh I did. Uh, uh, Bingus. That's fine. That's fine. I'll just, uh, it's probably better if uh, they don't do that because they've got a lot of stuff too. <laughs> How? Uh, 120 feet. So, yeah, everything on the deck is going to be in his path. So, he's going to target Haru and he's going to shoot a chromatic bolt at you. Can you roll me yeah. a d3? Well, oh no, wait. God. Sorry, d4. Good. Huzzah! Oh, okay. well. You are lucky. It doesn't miss anyway. But uh, it, it's just it to choose the damage. It doesn't miss anyway? Oh, shit. It, it misses. Yeah. It does. <laughs> this, like, rainbow-colored bolt zooms by you. What color was it? Like, a rainbow. Do I know what damage it was? Nope. Because it zooms by? Val, it's your turn. Oh, I guess I you didn't. Heard, you heard no other guns. <laughs> I'll reload the guns. <laughs> okay. <laughs> and it is now the start of your turn. Uh, note. I need you to roll me a d20. Me? Yes, because you're not piloting the ship. Well, yeah, I'm going back now. <laughs> mm -hmm. But it's the start oh. of the turn. Oh, so no. Much. So... The DC starts really low and gets worse the longer you leave the ship. You roll the one. Yeah. <laughs> the ship is starting to go off course and ram into some asteroids. I need everyone on the deck to make a dexterity saving. Uh... Oh. Like we roll? Yes. All of you you have to roll individually. I just have the effects here. I don't actually have the uh things program. Things program. We didn't uh, look it up. Okay, so the only ones that fall prone are the creatures that are immune to it. So, perfect. You're all good. Uh, it will get worse the longer you leave it without a driver. Yeah, I'm going Louis, back. I'm going go. back Did right that now. Tell me that the preacher is immune to being prone. Nope, the preacher totally succeeded. It's the okay, swarms yeah, yeah. that are immune to Yeah, yeah, prone. that's what I thought. Okay. Yeah. I just needed to know, because I'm going to go gunning at the guy. If I can. All right, that was me too. Yeah, um, we're... Anything else for your turn, Val? No, I sit in the chair. Okay. Uh, Cleo's turn. Cleo is going to just back up here, so that she's not... <laughs> literally getting absorbed by the swarm Slurp. and then she's going to beat the shit out of the swarm for a nice 41 points of damage uh, Dozer's gonna look <laughs> Dozer's gonna look back at Val thumbs up okay thumbs up yes this is fine and then Narmer is going to keep fighting down here with the swarm he's in Swarm time. This Ooh. swarm is going to stay right here because it actually doesn't need to move cool. uh, to the one attack that... both of you. <laughs> uh, it's going to attack Arana and uh, Haru. No. Once each. Cool. So it does hit I one of you. Me. Shame that wasn't switched around or else we would have both. Slash. Swarm 2 is going to 
move Dang. over top of again. Doug. Uh, and this is the one being targeted. So. I don't know. I keep forgetting shields before or after I know the rule. It's going to make two attacks at Doug. Both of them are going oh, wait, to miss. Wait. Swarm three on uh, Nami is going to attack Nami and. Cleopatra. Cleopatra once. Miss, miss. Swarm four is just going to attack. Normal twice. Miss hit. Oh, it doesn't do damage. I keep forgetting. <laughs> Swarm five up here now is going to move over top of Haru. Wow. Um, should Swarm of Parasites 1 have taken some Radiant... Or no, this fell. Never mind. Uh, yeah, that fell, and I don't, did not do Fire Shield because I did not know. Yeah. Or I would not have done it if I did not know. <laughs> Two misses. <laughs> and now the Hover Tank is going to fire. Wait, was that my phone you guys heard? Uh, yeah, probably. Know, Somebody. As well. Fuck, fuck yeah, that was definitely mine because <laughs> I know I know it can be heard from my mic. Nice. Okay, so you are both targeted. Ah, uh, nice. So this is a deck save, which Get means to share with the class. Uh, Marissa's good. No fears about Marissa. That's nice. that being said, I'm pretty sure you're not very good at these deck saves. Ah, uh, that's not true. Just... Doug just oh fuck! Well, well now it is. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's not a uh, baby. I added. Okay, I got resilience literally to add my proficiency bonus to my dex. Okay, so it's not trash. Well, the thing it's is, actually, you need it. It's yeah, doable, you need an eighteen or higher. Tw the DC is twenty five. That's not. That's not good. Yeah, it's a. It's a really massive. I can do blast. it. It's doable. Eighteen or higher. It still sucks ass. So Gross. it is going to hit you both. I okay. Do I know if this is going to be like a really powerful slap? This is, is going to potentially be catastrophic. I indomitable it to okay. automatically succeed. Okay, that's. I use good. my reaction to indomitable. Uh, so you take. Uh, so we'll we'll do you second. Uh, and if you see how the damage works in this, and you're familiar with. Uh, Wait, it's not even a reaction. You can reroll a saving throw if you fail. If you do so, you must use the new rule. Oh, yeah. It's not even a reaction. No. So the Swarm of Parasites Makes is sense. turned to dust. Oh, my God. Uh, <laughs> Holy shit. Uh, you take just take 30 yeah. force damage, and you're good. Holy That's not too bad. Cow. <laughs> Uh, and then that is the end of the hover tank's turn. Ouch. And that is the end of the hover tank. Uh, oh, this yeah. skimmer no, is going to move over Just does 30 here. damage, you know. It looked like it didn't do half, though. Is that it what did you're not. talking about? It does okay. exactly 30 if you succeed. If you succeed? Okay. That's good to know. Uh, this one's going to shoot you with five magic missiles. Of course it will. I'm not doing so well. And it did three, five, four, four, five on its magic Jesus. missile. Of course. No, of course. <laughs> That's fine. That's fine. Well, Doug, where was your AC when you needed it? Oh, ah, no. <laughs> not the saving throws and the automatic hits. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. It's fine. He's still a very beefy boy. Uh, the skimmers are now swarming the hover tank because they're like, this is bad. Also, it just shot something else, too. I, I don't know what this one also shot. Oh, no, sorry. Uh, the name of the hover tank is Hover Tank Screen Remnant. It looks like two targets, but it's not. <laughs> it looks yeah. like two targets, but it's not. It's just one full name, yeah. Yeah, and then this one's gonna move over here. Uh, 
Uh, the hover tank's looking pretty beat up now. Like, you're surprised at how much damage it's taken just from being peppered by magic missiles. No, I mean, it's your turn. Oh, it is my turn. All right. I guess I'll... I saved. I would have died. <laughs> you wouldn't have died. It was no, only it only did ninety eight damage. damage. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It only did okay. most of your health. Only, it averages. You know. It averages ninety five damage. Jesus Christ. <laughs> hey, it uh, takes a full turn for it to fire, and you can avoid it by just getting out of range. That's okay. true. I, I can't select my character. Thanks. Very cool. Uh, I guess I'll. Very cool. I got fireball and the rest of damage, but I might just do lightning, lightning again to heal myself up. It's up to you. The uh, lightning bolt. I know they're weak to it, but I think these guys shouldn't be that bad until they're that bad. It'll fail. Made damage. My fucking damage. My fucking damage. Okay, and that's all for your turn? Or are you yeah. good? Yeah. <laughs> Is there a point? I don't know. No, I'm good. Aru. Noise. Uh, Gun disconnected. Creatures. Gun fucking died. They are a swarm of me. I'm gonna move. Yeah, which means they can't fit through cracks and small. Areas. No, but there's not really. I know. I'm just saying they don't have like the swarm ability to go through. Uh, what are you using here, Hara? Blazing web. Okay. Uh, the dropship is sixty feet oh, in the 60 air. Feet. Yeah, no, it's a D with D for dropship. <laughs> yeah. Okay, but these things are all set. Where is the fucking target find? There we go. Cool. So. So yeah, deck saves to start, um, and point. Uh, swarm is a success. Preacher oh, failed. Swarm succeeded. So the preacher is going to use his reaction to re-roll his save. Makes sense. And obviously, I choose strain hover tank. I run it. Douglas and I said. Cool. So they all save. Okay. Uh, so do you want me to roll it separately, or are you gonna restore? the health uh yeah just just uh, i'll just restore the health okay because it's three six initially and then one d6 for every turn they remain yeah so he gets six hp back and it remains uh or oh yeah so and they become restrained on field save they didn't blah 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 difficult terrain for anything yep. that ends there then i will use my bonus action to uh Ghost flame for teleport bloop. Sure. To back off the remainder of my movement. Sounds good. Actually, I'll back off towards Arana so that she's not alone. <laughs> Sounds good. Okay, boom. Oh, it seems that Discord took a shit. Actually, yeah, and so did your everything, shit. actually. Yeah. It seems like it was One just second. you took a shit. <laughs> that is your turn, Doug. No, I would have announced that. Just like Nick Romano. <laughs> Everyone, I am going to take a shit. Shit yourself now. Oh, Doug's getting pizza. Fuck! Why is it Gun and Doug, the two having problems? It's your guy's turn. I'm, I'm launching back in. Hold on to your butts. I had pizza earlier. Why is everyone Sorry. eating pizza? Why not? It's pizza. What did I have for dinner? Oh yeah, I had breakfast wraps. It was so fucking good. Nice. Not some shitty frozen ones either. I I made them. I made the bacon and the eggs. Got some nice cheese. Some I think nice I used cheese. some rice in them for like a. Cause I didn't I didn't want to make any potatoes. That was too much work. Potatoes. I wish you could buy hash browns at reasonable prices anywhere, but unfortunately Costco doesn't sell them. Feels bad, man. 
It's okay, it's still Doug's turn. He's not here either. Okay. Uh, you know what? Man. I'm running. Oh no, I don't have to run. I've got a water here. I lied. <laughs> man. Uh, I why would you man. fucking lie about such a thing? I don't know. None of my characters ever lie, but I do for some reason. I can't believe that fucking charades talk to guys out of skill on it. You guys should have just sacked Har uh Mabu. You should have just sacked him. I couldn't do Har couldn't do that. Uh Val couldn't do that. I mean, no. <laughs> oh, thank you, Kyle. I'm so glad that my brother gets access to the stupidest shit in the world. <laughs> Dog, Dog your pizza dog. already. Duh. Carrying the largest pizza ever. Guys, look at this frog. That's an. Is that a frog or an axolotl? I don't know. I just. I don't know. Don't ask questions. Poor creature. Is he getting pizza? Apparently. Allegedly. Oh, cool. That is a unfortunately large frog. I love that guy. King Larry. You know what's great about him? Mm -hmm. Really, really cool art I've done of him. Yeah? Around. Yeah, here it is. <laughs> That's so good. Honestly, I never expected him to be my one of my favorites, but he is. One day, Max will return, and when he does, he will have pizza, and hopefully take his turn in combat. <laughs> Guys, somebody, somebody leaked more, more, more of his nudes. Uh, I think the original of that is the best by far. Yeah, I, yeah, you can't beat the original. Uh, it's pressured still. I think one of the things that's been bad about the congestion for me in particular is that it's been causing a lot of nosebleeds. 
Oh jeez. Like all, I'm... all I've had been worrying about congestion wise is the fact that my teeth hurt. Oh, that sucks. At least I'm not bleeding from my face. Well, I mean, I'm I'm already prone to nosebleeds and stuff like that, right? So just like the congestion causes additional pressure buildup, and so it just bleeds like pretty consistently in the morning. <laughs> like I blow my nose in the morning, I'm like, ah, yes, the expected blood. Uh, but like, uh, it's nothing too too bad. Uh, gives me headaches though. Not not from the bleeding, just from the congestion. Oh yeah. <clears throat> oh, Surprise your teeth hurt. Back, huh? My teeth hurt, but that's because my wisdom tooth is coming. Oh god. What so just, like, the greatest I mean? adaptation of Lord of the Rings. What? Uh, I don't. Right. Oh yeah, I guess I have to do this real quick. <laughs> It's just a GIF, by the way. You can look at it if you want, Avery. I'm crocheting. It's fine. <laughs> I once once this thing is done, it will be the most expensive single piece of clothing I own. Oh, oh there's the pizza oh, boy. Look who decided to come look, back. <laughs> they took forever. They they keep getting lost at night. Oh, I feel. Like, to be fair, your your apartment has hard. more than it's, it's, one driveway. Yeah, that's the thing. It's like somewhat kind of confusing, but still, it, the amount of people <laughs> that get lost coming here is is abnormal. I feel. Yeah. Considering Anyways, how many people sorry, live in that I building, will though. Attack stuff. Is it my turn? Yeah. It's yeah. Turn. It's been your turn okay. for a while now. Yeah. Um, I get towards the dropship is up and yeah, the it's sky, six feet right? in the air. So unless yeah. you can jump really high, I think you're yeah. out of luck. That's not. No, no, that's not it. It's not in my way to attack the preacher, right? No. Yeah. I would appreciate if you guys chose some fucking squares. Am I not on? Oh, fuck me. <laughs> I can't see I'm where I am. Square. Okay, sorry. This oh, is a square. By the way, Mark here. <clears throat> Don't fear me. I'm going to. Oh. Bon bonus that action. Fucking awful game. Second. I win. said I was gonna do. <laughs> So I'm doing it. Yeah, ah, terrible. Quick. Whatever. It's better. I now then... have not one, not two, but three games with lethal as the first word in your title. Amazing. Wait. Lethal Company, Lethal oh, that League, misses. That's and nice. Lethal League Blaze. You know what I'm going to do? <laughs> well, that sounds like yeah, he's wearing armor. This I'll make one of the attacks, uh, just a ten with the necklace. Are the you going to say Izzy? Amulet. I'll make it a ten plus. Oh right, because that's not like a. Is that not a? It's not a. No, a no, it's item? not a. No, no, no. That's why it just it's has nice. a number of uses, and then it's gone. Just right. once. It's just oh, once a day. Oh, just once. You okay. can you can make an attack roll be a ten, on the die. So cool. does it so, yeah, that hits. hit? Nice. A bit closer than uh, you probably would have liked, but yeah, it hits. Yeah, it's a gamble, but at least I can do damage, so that's the second hit. Boom, you hit him. It resisted. What did yeah, it resist? Yeah, I wonder, what What do you think it resisted? It's a, oh, it's the fucking a preacher. Holy priest. <laughs> <laughs> uh, does it take uh, an action to swap weapons? Uh, no, just... you can do one for free. Then I will swap to the halberd, knowing that it does less than I'd like to, and it's also mm -hmm. named preacher. So I will attack with the halberd as the th last uh, attack. Nice. Yeah, that's and uh, do this amount of damage. Fifteen. There you go. That's my turn. Uh, well, I mean, Marissa can attack as well. Why not? Did you? How many attacks did you make? Three. One was missed. One to miss. Yeah, but you turn it into a hit. What? No, no, it doesn't turn it into a hit. Oh, okay. So I can choose gotcha. yeah, yeah, yeah. the attack to be a ten. Does that make okay. sense? Yeah, yeah. No, so I missed no. one, and then I attack. Or I, I did chose a, to hit a ten. I chose to hit with a ten, gotcha. and then attack with the turn. Yeah. All the guns are loaded, by the way. 
I know, but I'm, <laughs> I want this preacher dead, so too bad. He's not that bad. Oh, fuck. I didn't even... Holy okay. fuck. I gave this thing multi-attack? Dude, the preacher's... That's my turn. Well, that's <laughs> why I'm here. <laughs> Arana, it's why? your turn. Why do you think I came all this way? <laughs> Hooray! Um... Well, shit, gang. The fuck can I do? I don't know. Cast spells. Hit things. Jump onto the ally hover thing. <laughs> that was my 60 foot really vertical well. leap. The hover tank's really close. The, the hover tank is like basically 10 feet off the ground. It's an ally though, so. Don't know how, that, how much it will help you. I, I don't know either. So, I don't know. They're lined up pretty nicely. Could I. No, it's, should I send me lightning bolt? <laughs> I don't have lightning bolt. I have call lightning. Oh, okay. Gotcha. How do you call have, lightning in space? Can I, legal, can I legally let you do call lightning in space? Space clouds. Space lightning. Or are they called orc clouds? <laughs> space lightning. It's magic. There's lightning in space. I, I would let you if you want, but it's just funny to think of it. Yeah. Uh, about instead, we just go with the sun. Well, beam. I think there is lightning in the space, but it's not the same kind of lightning as it's like, not, no. atmosphere lightning. Uh, summon giant insect. Do I just summon a tyranid? Like, <laughs> Shut we're off, in space. Man. What are you? I'm gonna cast Sunbeam. Sunbeam? Sounds good. Fuck it, I'll go just keep doing AoE shit. Uh, just noted <laughs> that, um... Oh, what? I fucked that up. They should be immune to the blinded condition because they're a swarm. You should be immune to the blinded condition. Okay. Yeah, shut up, Noah. But, uh, they don't... Yeah, the damage is good to go. You can get them to uh, make their saves. Uh... Just pull up the combat tracker again for the fifth time today because it keeps fucking disappearing on me. Let's make sure I actually have both clouds marked with me. Can't get them. Can't get that one. Oh, fuck you, you piece of sh There we go, Christ. Uh, <laughs> Alright, uh, it's still. Order of operations is still. Yeah, saving throw. First. Well, oh, great. They suck. Uh, taste, power of sunshine and bullshit. <laughs> the bright light hurts their eyes and does an absurd amount of radiant damage. Great. Uh Am I at risk of being roasted by the fucking cannon this turn? No. Nope. Has it made any the, indication that it's going to be targeting this no, turn? No, no, no. The, the tank, uh, it loses its turn after it fires. So it takes a turn to lock onto something, and then it can shoot its machine gun. Then on the next turn, it shoots the target, and then doesn't do anything else. And then on its next turn, it'll shoot the guns and target again. So you've got you still don't know what it's going to target until its next turn. It has lethargy, like uh, yeah, it's sun, like not sunbeam, no hyper beam. Hyper beam, it must yeah. recharge except jet one. Shit, shit, shit is going to come back up the stairs now that she's heard the cannon get fired, and she's going to poke up and see everything going on and just be like, oh, fucking dropship, and she's going to shoot at the dropship with her weapon it's a nice hit on it boom the drop chip's looking pretty fucked up but it's not dead yet damn that means it's going down below <laughs> <I'm sorry. clears throat> ah god how you doing I'll down have, there i'll have you roll a d4 for me nami uh we're no. gonna re-roll one and four 
Grace. Cool. Perfect. I think I'll be fine, hopefully. I have issues. I guess I'll run or something. Fuck. I don't. I don't want uh, them to ruin the engine. It's a swarm every time. Whoops! All oops! All swarm. But there's also this fucking abomination. Boom. Yeah, it's getting really bad down there. <laughs> it literally is a parasitic abomination. Oh, and it gets to go! <laughs> I'm last in initiative! Uh, the... Okay, so it is going to target you with its eye of terror. So its big eye looks at you, and you cannot look away from it. Okay, cool. Uh, at the start of your turn, you can choose to make a wisdom save to attempt to look away. Otherwise, you can only look at it and only choose it as targets. What if it's AoE attacks? AoE attacks are fine, but the main target has to be it. How does AoE count? That's main target. Everything's a main target <laughs> if it's in the area. You need to z you need to target it exactly. Like if you're going to use fireball, it's at the parasitic abomination. It's oh, the, the targeted yeah. point is the parasitic abomination. All right. With lightning enough. bolt, you just have to aim it straight at the parasitic abomination with no changing uh, direction. All uh, right. Then for its turn. It is going to reality drain. I think it's, yeah, it's a cone. So what it's going to do is step over here through its swarms, and it's going to target you. You can, walk, you can walk here? And the Cleopatra. Uh, yeah, it can jump down there. It's dangerous, like it's difficult terrain, but it ignores difficult terrain. Cool. Um, it is going to use Reality Drain on you. Okay, so you succeed, uh, but Cleopatra fails. Let me double check with this. Oh, is that an int save? So, what? yes it is. So you will take uh, half damage. Cleo will take all of it. Partially because Partial. she has 20 temp HP. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, creature fails to save by five or more. What did you, uh Okay, Cleo did fail by five or more. So you have to choose one of these effects. Okay, it's going to choose this one. It's going to keep taking psychic damage for quite a while. Cool. Yeah, it looks like it's getting really bad down there. <laughs> they might need some help. Uh, it is now the preacher's turn. People don't preacher. know that. Preacher is going to heal everyone in Zora again. No, you asshole. Then, since you're so eager, it's going to attack you. Whoa! It swings its mace, and it misses. And it swings its mace, and it misses. It misses. Nice. Fire again, uh, and it misses. Val, it is your turn. It Val, is it is my... Wait, wait, I'm letting the cat up. Cat up? Yes. Okay. <clears throat> uh, I pilot. No, no big guns were fired. I pilot the ship, and I think that's it. Cool. Do you want to get a readout on what everything's doing? Oh yeah, sure, sure. Uh, the bottom floor is being completely <clears throat> fucking overrun at this point, and they are struggling to kill the stuff that is showing up. Mm. Uh, and that's where the dropship is. Uh, the top floor, however, is doing relatively well, all things considered. I will, over the PA system, let everyone know the status. Mm -hmm. 
aha. Communication. So now everyone knows what the fuck is going on. <laughs> so Cleo takes some psychic damage, not feeling so good. And then it's going to attack with the thermal blade on the swarm. That's a hit. Does some damage. <coughs> Swarm's looking pretty fucked up. Gozer's going to look at Val and go, do you want me to go and try and help? Sure. And he's going to run over here, open the door, see a creature and go, oh, you fucking religious freaks. And then he's going to shoot his beam rifle at it. And miss. Fuck. Narmer down here is going to do his best to try and beat the uh, swarm away. Almost finished it off. This swarm of parasites is going to attack Haru and Arana both once. Big shocker. Uh, it is going to hit Arana. Again? Yep. And Arana's going to drop concentration on Sunbeam. Yes. Uh, I always love using this uh, fucking spell. Fun. Such a good 6th level spell. My favorite 6th level spell. This, uh, this swarm is going to attack both Nami and Cleo. I love how 6th level this spell gonna is. going to miss twice. And it's going to move here to kind of encompass everyone again. Cool. This swarm is going to attack Snarmor, do no damage, because it can't. This swarm is going to move over to defend the preacher. It's going to attack I, uh, Doug. As, as it well. moves towards me, okay. I will attack it. Sure. And uh, if I hit, it will lose its... Wow. I don't know if I can lose its speed to zero. That doesn't. Yeah, because really it's it's but... it's only five feet away, as well. No, I so know. It's one movement puts it in range anyway. I I I know. Yeah. It also doesn't make sense to stop its movement when there's multiple things to move. Yeah. But I will attack it overall. Twice. My. Uh, you're also the... still targeting the preacher. Okay. Just untarget the preacher. Did I hit the, the thing? Preacher. Yeah. Just untarget the preacher. I did. Yeah, yeah. Cool. And then okay. you're good. To damage it? Yep. Nice. Yeah. And then and then it can do its turn. Cool. Anyway, <clears throat> it attacks Doug twice. It actually hits you. It once. hits. Yeah. Ten damage. Word. And the other swarm down here is also going to try and attack Narmer and do no damage. But they're too, they're too stupid to care. Okay. Shield's bad. Uh, the hover tank is now going to target the swarm of parasites 5, the one next to you, Doug, with its cannon. Okay. Uh, and then it's going to fire its pintle mount guns. It'll put one at the skimmer, because it'll probably kill it if it hits. Yep. Skimmer down, and then three into this one. Miss, hit, hit. So fusion cannon is, cannon is coming in on the Swarm of Parasites 5. Sounds good. The skimmers are going to completely ignore Doug, because they're focusing on their tank now. <clears throat> Not much I can do about that. Doug pulls out his gun. Doug has a gun! He's just gonna whip it out. Are any of them shooting at me? No, they're all shooting oh, at the hover I get thing. to keep concentration. So these swarms can take damage on the creature, too. Are their turns, like, technically done yet? Or... Uh, I'm still rolling the damage, but... Yeah, okay, that's fine. We are now good. It is now Nami's turn. Okay. Then they I guess I'll try it out with some saves. Yeah, you can roll damage on the one stuck in there. And then, yeah, you can... Sorry, what are you doing? 
the wisdom save for the parasitic oh, abomination. Oh yes. Roll wisdom save. The DC is sixteen. Wow. Oh. <laughs> wow, Noah, that's incredible. You gotta love my. Right. So you're good. You can look away from the abomination now. Well, cool. the main thing is I wanted to, you know, not target it. Man, this will be a juicy fireball, but also I can hit it with, uh, I can hit them all with lightning. You could, yep. Yeah. I want to do that. Go ahead. Do you want me, guys, do you want me to risk the damage? You think it's fine? So long as you can repair it, it's fine. Alright, cool. Well, thing is, I think it is better to just lightning full. <laughs> oh. I mean, fireball's a lot of damage, too, but it's entirely up to me. Yeah, they are weak to it, so it's going to do more damage. So I think that's, uh -huh. you know, it's fine. These shower. Need to target. I need to click myself. It's hard to click myself. Thanks. No you, problem. You. Do I hit the dropship as well? Um. Yeah. If it's if it's there, the dropship is at level with that entrance. So yeah. Yeah, I can hit the dropship as well. Uh, all right. Uh, fireball fifth level. <laughs> I could lose fifth level. Wizard, try not to use fireball change challenge impossible. Hey, I've used other spells. <laughs> They're weak to fire. It's a tactical decision. It's a tactical decision. Fireball. All right, Everyone's uh... weak to fire. <laughs> if you use enough of them. They oh, all failed. Like everybody failed, yeah. I'm doing fifth level. Sounds good. Go big or go home. <laughs> yeah, that'll do it, dude. <laughs> yeah, that'll do it. I got the shit. Did, wait. Did it? Oh, yeah, no. These things have an absurd amount of HP. I'm sorry, I forgot. These swarms are ridiculous. This is the highest. They're also not vulnerable to fire, it seems. The swarms are. Forms. No, I meant the uh, abomination isn't. Yeah, the abomination is not. It's too slimy and wet. Do I need to make a roll for the damage? Uh, yes, I need you to roll a d20. A d20. Oh. I dropped it and rolled a 1. Alright, here we go. Eight. So, unfortunately, the DC was 10 to not damage it. So, you have damaged the engine, but it's not critical yet. It's Can I bardic inspiration? <laughs> What is what is the target for Bardic Inspiration? All right, let's see. <laughs> to inspire the engine. Does it? The it it's full a creature. Of souls. It's powered by souls. No. <laughs> <laughs> I could also just give myself a fourteen. That's fine. So, all you need to know is at the end of your next turn, the engine is going to actually break. Right now, it is just is still functioning. So I fix it. I fix off. it here. Uh, no, you will need to go it down to the the wheels to fix it. So you'll need to hop over the edge to the, into the difficult terrain. Mm -hmm. uh, and then once you fix it, since it's not off yet, it's not fully destroyed. You won't need to restart it at the thing. So at the end of my next turn. At the end of your next turn, it will shut off though. So yeah, you want to try and get it fixed before the end of your next turn. And I'm guessing it's one action to fix it? Uh, yes, but it is a check. Yep. Haru, how's it going? Uh, pretty good. I suppose, well, I got Blazing Web, so that's cool. Very cool. Thank you, Kanye. Thank uh, you, Kanye. Very cool. Creature is still very healthy, which is not so cool. Is Arana, like, still... Arana is right there. Down, yeah, down to the left of you. You like and is down. No, no, no. Arana's up. Okay. Okay, this is the last of my flares. I'm just gonna I'm gonna attack this swarm and probably just uh do a do a rejuvenating strike on it. Sure, go for it. Oh, that was the sky ship cannon. Oh, I'm also targeting three things right now. Easy triple attack yeah, for one free. Sec. I mean, it's all programmed. You can do your stuff before. I need to get up and change something here. Yep. Uh, first attack. I'm gonna risk it for the biscuit on the second one. And still You're hit. You're so lucky. Very easy to hit. 
Uh, yeah, okay. Uh, spider bite, third level. So that's 48. Uh, it is 2d8 plus, uh, so level one is 2d8, and then every level above that is an additional d8. So yeah, it's 2d8, or 48 total. So I'll add two of those. Oh, yeah, I'll add... And then you're splitting whatever this does is healing your ally? Yeah. Okay. I'm assuming it's probably all going to get sucked into... Actually, I think it all has to get sucked into Arana. Yeah, based on space. So 3, 8, 7, 3, 15, 21. It's 25. Oh, but right, you don't include the D6. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Because it, it splits the damage apart at the top there. So yeah. I saw that it did 25 radiant. So yeah, oh, okay. Arana, you heal 21 Radiant. Well, 21 health. <laughs> you, you heal 21 Radiant. Oh. Dies. Uh, anything else for your turn? Nope, that's pretty much all. Ah, okay, well, I will, like... No, I'll just, like, pop up on that. Try sure. to stay somewhat away. Not what is this under... massive... 30 foot. That is Blazing Web. You just can't ignore it. Oh, yeah, good. you don't deal with it. It's but... a giant flaming web if you're wondering. Huh. Pretty. Or just, you know, blue Spooch. web all over. It is your turn. Spooch. <coughs> Duke. Smack. He swings and he hits. Ouch. Ouch. Nice. May I attack three times, or will he do something? You can go three times, but on the third one, just wait a sec. Well, roll one at a time, and I'll let you know if you stop. One. Twenty. Yeah, you're good. You can hit him one more time. Cool. He's still looking pretty good. He's bloodied, but he's not uh, not critical yet. Action surge, very interesting. So it I'll do one. I'll do them one by one now. Why do you hate religious people? <laughs> he's continuously healing okay. everything around him. He's gonna use a reaction to heal himself forty HP on this head. God damn it! No. Forty. No. Get fucked. Hey, that's that's a. Uh... That's a limited resource that he has, and he just has. I know to it's fine. Himself. It's pretty much a um, much better second win, I guess. What's more interesting here is uh, he also has one to negate a crit, but he has oh. to use this now because he might not survive <laughs> Two more to attacks. get hit by a crit. Yeah. Yeah. So now, if you get a crit, you can. He can't. <laughs> he can't deny it. Shit. Oh, a miss. Oof. No, is that a hit? Oh, okay. That's a hit. Yeah. I thought that missed, too. That would have been really sad. 22, nice. He's looking fucked up, but he's still kicking. <sighs> and then Marissa will uh, beat his ass. Man, players are so <laughs> entitled. They can heal as much as they want, but the second I know, there's right? a healer on my team, oh, we got a fucking kill this guy it's so unfair <laughs> no it's not unfair it's it's tactical it's you, tactical you definitely could as well right using a smart character be like no the healer it does must go. i do use a smart character did you see how charade engaged with you guy that's true huh? <laughs> no i get it you guys want to fight me i know an easy way to stop you by using the people you love because i'm toxic true huh? yeah Coward. Well, no, it's just tactical. Like now tactical he's coward. Fucked up. Not much I could do. Arana, your turn. Gun. Oh, oh yeah. I, actually, though, oh, I sorry. will move. Okay, I'm scared ahead. of being shot by the cannon again. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's fair. Okay. Uh. 
If he wants to attack me, well, no, he used his reaction, right? Yeah. Uh, he did, yes. Yep. It's all according to plan. But... All according to Kaku. Except this dude's gonna shoot to... a massive cannon that may or may not kill me. Let's not do that. Haru, my bones hurt. <laughs> well, I tried. Okay. The swarm is in uh, in difficult terrain, Max. I don't think he can get to you. Actually? Yeah. I think you're good. Then I I'm guess gonna I'll just move. have to just one uh, square move. Or... They they can move thirty feet. So oh, okay. Then I'll stay over here. Yeah, it doesn't matter. Yeah, I'll I stay. meant it couldn't get to you over there. Oh, okay, which... okay, okay, okay. Yeah, it could have got to you if you were standing next to the yeah. creature. But... Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna stay right here. <clears throat> it is nine p.m. It is nice. Arana, yeah. once you do your turn, we'll Yeah. Hang. Uh I was just gonna give myself a fat cure wounds just so I can stay in the fight. Makes sense. Yeah, makes sense. <laughs> Respectable. The healer should uh, probably stay at conscious. The healer yeah. also didn't give himself fucking the twenty one HP or the twenty five HP that he was supposed to Did he not? Did you not give yourself the No, he's HP? still at seventy HP and I or seventy oh wounds and I know God. he was there. Arana, did you heal the healing that Haru gave you? I did it. You dog. Okay, then I won't be using as fat of a healing spell. <laughs> you dog. It's a third level Seth cure wounds dog. on uh, <laughs> fucking. Got to untarget these shitheads. Target myself. Uh, one, two. It's because I was trying to figure out who had more damage, me or Arana, when uh, Haru was doing his thing, and I was like, "Oh no, Arana does have more damage." Okay, I can I can take another couple kicks in the teeth before I pass out. Now, hooray! Hooray! <laughs> Man, imagine if you guys had to fight this terrain first, and then you had to do this without their help. Yeah, that would actually suck. Yeah. Suck. And then imagine if you compounded the fact that you're like, let's fight charade anyway. <laughs> let's just make enemies. We'd be in a different fight let's right now. A completely, completely different fight. Yeah. <laughs> wake up and choose violence. <laughs> Willingly choose violence. Okay, well, that was fun. Uh, it is Hatsep Shift's turn. I will remember that for next time. And, uh, yeah. Woohoo! That looks dangerously tasty. Sorry. Living off of soup and water the last couple of days has uh, made e internet food posting very very tempting. It's fair. I've been eating good. <laughs> yeah, my. Oh yeah, that's that's a lie. I I, I caved and I bought myself a burrito bowl yesterday. Nice. Do you like bananas? Here's a banana post again. I had some udon yesterday, and that was really nice. <gasps> Listen, me sitting over here with my fucking canned <laughs> chunky soup, and you got a fucking udon. You said you got a burrito yeah, bowl. Yeah, spaghetti. Yeah. Dinner, spaghetti. dinner today was chilly. That was really nice. Tell me what I got to my spaghetti. I, I guess good night stream. Tommy? Yeah, no, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Bye. Say, say go good night to stream. Bye. Now. Bye. Yeah, you guys should have probably stopped being sick.